Everything should be, oh, uh, it, it, there we go. There we go, everything should be good, everything should be starting. Okay, so it's up on Twitch. I'm now just waiting on YouTube. There is YouTube. Alrighty, there we go. So let's see, so we had a, a Ben Price, we had a Field Fighter, we had an Unwanted Hydro, a Joshua Bowen Fagati, we had a Ben Price again, and then Unwanted Hydro, Bloom, Patty Robinson, Thank you, Ram, for all you do. I love how much fun and joy you have making these videos, and I always have to make my day better when I can catch one of your videos or catch a stream. Yeah! Always, I'm always glad to hear that, Patrick Robinson. I always love hearing that people are enjoying the content. Uh, just a for you said on something. So, how's it going? It's going pretty good. Uh, any spare generals? Yes, we do actually have quite a few spare generals. Oh, excuse me. Uh, because right now, let's see what. How many people have taken generals so far? Um, oh, that's supposed to say zero. We've taken, okay, so, so far we're at, um, 17. So about half of our generals are still available. We've got about, yeah, half, we've got about 35 generals initially, so we've got the stocks. We can kind of split this up by, uh, family first, if you want to try and, uh, be a specific family member, Josh, uh, Joshua Bowen Pagati. We've got the stocks, we've got the Mandalays, we've got the Glovers, we've got the Mormonts, we've got the Umbers. I think, um, there's one more Umber available. Yeah, there's one more umber, umber available. Uh, we have the Flints, we have the Dustins. Nobody's been a Dustin yet. Um, we have the Talhots, we have the Locks. No one's been a Lock yet either. Um, we have the Carowinds, which only one of the Carowinds has been selected so far. Ricewell, Reed. Uh, Reed has actually been taken. And then uh, Magnar, Wool, uh, Woolfield, and that is it. Let's see, do you have, finally have enough money to build me a Glover army? We, we, we can try to. We can try to maybe build a, a Glover army at some point now. Uh, and then let's see, so... So you want to be a Dustin. So which Dustin do you want to be, Joshua Bowen Fagati? So we've got Theon and Theo. <laughs> Such a difference. Uh, currently one of them is in uh, Barrowton, and the other one is currently in uh, Torrens Square. So that's where they currently are. If you want to look... Oh, that's Eddard. Uh, no. Uh, it was... Wait, I thought you were in... Oh, was he in the region of Torrens Square? Where the fuck did the other Dustin go? Here he is. Winter so, is coming. he's 33, and this guy's 65. So if you want to be the younger one, uh, he, that'd be Theo Dustin. But also, I don't know if age matters a ton, because this guy's 73, and is still kicking. Still considered a good fighter at 73. Like, Rob Mormont, I don't know if he's ever going to die. Honestly, I kind of hope he never will. So Joshua Bowen Fagati shall be Theo Dustin. Alrighty. So Joshua. I love how my thing, I've read it, written that enough. It's just like, oh, you mean this, right? Yes, okay, thank you. So Theo Dustin. So Theo Dustin, there we go. Um, and let's see what else is going on. Let's see, can you check my stats since I wasn't able to see them yesterday? Yes, Patrick Robinson, I can do so. Because uh, your character was helping out with, not when, uh, yes, with Winter Tree. So, uh, Jory Hornwood, he is Lord Hornwood, uh, Hardy Just Master. Also, I kind of feel like I'm sad that I don't have you actually in there because this is actually a huge bonus. Like, 25% discount on construction costs, which is crazy. Um, Hardy Drill Master, you have with you got a Hornwood bow, which actually gives you more health. A greedy court attendant, I see. Uh, you've got a squire. You do have a wolf pup. I love how, like, everybody's a goddamn wolf pup. Wolf pup. Uh, you've got some northern hard leather, which doesn't really do much, but it's there. Uh, you're a member of House Hornwood, Proven Commander, Virile, uh, Dauntless, Loyal, uh, Feels Respected, Talent for Command, Tactically Sound, Adept Scout, uh, Good Cavalry, Good Fighter, Cruel and Cunning, Noble and Rule, Disrespects Prisoners, uh, competent attacker can tell a tale and uh, soft judge and healthy supply lines. Also, I did try and see if we can uh, I can give myself access to the Night's Watch units. I did change the code uh, and uh, technically I'm supposed to be able to recruit them, but nothing's happening right now, so I don't know if I'm going to have to try and do something about that or just have to wait and see. Uh, Ramp, you said in Discord that I can't have Flint's Finger because it is ancestral home, but Janie has Burrowton and that's the ancestral seat of House Dustin. Is it? Is that the ancestral seat of House D is Dustin? Oh, uh, fuck. I I'm gonna have it so that, like, today, 
is gonna be the last day. Well, he just literally just take took it. Let's see, because I think you've got the Lord title of House Dustin. Now actually tell me. Uh, you're the Lord of uh, Dariton. Two to be determined, member of House Dustin. Interesting. Um, damn it. There's too many families. There's way too many families for me to keep track of Winter all of this. Coming. But I think I'll be saying that primarily I wanted to make sure that I was giving out the ancestral lands if you were the eldest, if someone selected the eldest of the house that they are of. So, because uh, Theon, Dustin, was not taken, Baratin is fine to be under control of somebody else. That's gonna how that's gonna how I'm gonna play it. Kind of same with you. Nobody was Roderick Flint, so nobody gets uh, Flint's finger. Um, it was instead no, Morris Flint was taken, so the younger. And I think that's how I'm gonna go about it, so the elder characters are the ones that are I'm rewarded for that. Because otherwise it just gets a little bit confusing all over the place. So, for now I'll have it so that uh, if nobody decides to be like, Roderick Flint, then this Ancestral Land will be up for grabs after today. That's how I'm gonna play it. Let's see, awesome. So I want the Dustin name to survive, Ram. <laughs> I'll try and see if I can. Let's see. Uh, Ram, how do I get an army? Um, try and remind me, and if I actually remember, I will try and recruit an army, is basically the thing. Uh, I've already now added in the money we got from, uh, everybody's, uh, bribes and stuff, or them buying titles and stuff. Um, and now I'm gonna make sure we first focus on building some more, tr uh, construction stuff to try and improve our economy more. Because right now, uh, Winterfell, uh, White Harbor... Also, another reason why the White Harbor is... I'm focusing so much on trade with White Harbor. White, uh, trade does increase growth. Trade on its own will eventually increase growth. So that's why I haven't been focusing on White Harbor that much with that. Torrens Square and then Barrowton are two other areas that I know I want to keep trying to improve. Um, simply because I think eventually we'll make a decent amount of money from these. So, like, these are my best ones that I've got for right now. So, like, you can grab that. Um, I can grab the larder here, which will give you guys about, yeah, about another hundred. Um, Winterfell. Oh. How much does that give us right now? About 90, and that gives us three more. Sure. Grab that, we'll say. Um, bup, 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 bup. Let's see, and then can I have uh, Dustin Mint under my command ramp? Yes, you can. I, I will try and make sure, because this was brought up in the comments on the last stream. Um, I do like the idea that primarily people will recruit units that are of their own house when they set out. I think basically the way I'm going to kind of play it off, because it's going to be difficult if people want to try and conquer like the entire map with just doing that. Um, basically, that's like your kind of like house guard that kind of follows you around. And you can make you be recruit an entire army of house guard, but as you maybe expand outward to other areas, you're gonna have to like take advantage of other family houses. And slowly but surely, like your house guard might be whittled down and then maybe you're just like, okay, we're gonna be done conquering. We'll go back and retrain our forces. I think that kind of makes a lot of sense. Hey, uh, let's see, Saul and Joras? Saul, I'm gonna say Saul. Saul, I'll say that. Uh, Banana Daniel, Banana, how do you go, man? Let's see, um, I can have Robert Flint. Sure, Stonewalker, I'll give you Robert Flint. So I will put you down as Robert Flint. Roderick, sorry. Roderick Flint. Roderick Flint. So I'll put you down as him, Stonewalker. Also, Stonewalker, if you put down a color on the XL sheet, I will put you onto the map uh, showcasing that you control this piece of land. Flint. Oh, that's uh, so Roderick. Roderick Oak. Flint. There we go. We now have a Flint. There we go. Ba -ba -da -ba -da. Let's see. Uh, hey, Gabby. How's it going, man? Let's see. Hey, Ram. Did you see my comment on Discord about you hiring sales swords? Yes, I did. Um, it feels a little awkward that uh, if you guys are, like, members. if your character is a sellsword um, in the Stark, like, houses, it feels a little awkward to me that, like, I have to, like, bribe you guys to give, like, actually come on over and help out. But I think it kind of makes sense. I'll just see how things kind of go, like, after we properly conquer, um, after we properly conquer the Free Folk up here. And then we start expanding elsewhere. Because I think it could make sense that, like, as, uh, as the king, uh, to make sure that you guys actually kind of help out in the wars as the sellswords, uh, I have to, like, incentivize you guys a little bit. Because I do want to try and let you guys have private armies the best I, as best as I can. Um, it's just a little difficult sometimes. But let's, let me make sure I get some more guys around here to be free upkeep. Um, but we are going to try and make sure you guys can have, like, your own personal armies that don't listen to me 
and I have to try and actually get you guys to listen um, by like bribing you at times. Let's keep uh, building more watchtowers. We almost have all the powers up here finally. I'll do what's best. Let's see. So, how would you say you are enjoying the mod so far? I know we have discovered some size issues, and uh, that it crashes just as much as other scrolls on official patch. Um, how do I get to the Excel sheet? Uh, I want to conquer out east. All righty, Stone Walker. Walker. Uh, Stone Walker. I have a. I have it in the description of the stream um, down below, or it's on my Discord. I have a link there um, to the Excel sheet where you can then put in information for your character. The and stuff North like remembers. That. Those are the two main areas to look is either in the description or on my Discord for the most part. I'm going to have it so drawn glava. I'm going to have you guys keep trying to send more men over this way. And also, I think um, I think I'm going to have to add it so that there's like one thing I'm going to do for um, for the cell swords. I think I technically need to say that I will make sure that you have units around you that are your own personal army up to your command. So, th uh, so if I recruit like three more Glover units, like say these three units, um, I will say these three Glover units are for sure a part of your army uh, as your sellsword army. I think that's what I'm going to be doing because otherwise, um, it gets a little awkward with how many. Uh, if I just have to have full stacks, as we can barely field full stacks ourselves right now, but I think that would kind of work out for what we're going to be doing with. Um, with our dudes. So let's again, keep trying to bring more guys over I'll this way. We've almost got everything remembers. lit up. I can't wait until the entire north is lit up. And I will eventually get back into properly uh, conquering things in a second here. Also, Castle Caron, I think I need to upgrade a little bit more too. Castle Caron actually makes me a decent amount of money. Um, stockades, battle bonus, windmill. I can grab the windmill. Yeah, that's about another 50, 40, 50 on there. Let's do that. Okay, so I think that, well, we actually have quite a bit of money. Because uh, of all the guy money you guys gave me, I think we can just keep getting more trade across the board. So like right there. Um, oh, this is uh, oh this is white tree actually. Uh, you guys here? I'm actually gonna get some better roads. Also, we're now uh, north of the wall. We're gonna have to try and rely on the wildlings a little bit more. I don't like that they don't have proper archers, but they have some pretty decent infantry, at least uh, stat wise in uh, offense. So we can try and get some of you guys. Um, I actually might grab some of the javelins. Otherwise, I think the spearmen will be better. Oh, man, your stats are shite. Oh, yeah, they're so bad. I, I think I'll at least grab the cannibals. The cannibals can do quite a bit of damage. Still kind of sad that like these areas right here can't do anything, can't recruit anything besides Stark bodyguards. So I think we'll have to just try and have it so that... I'll just have to have some, like, Glover men... Or not Glover men, Umber men, I think, will watch over these areas, possibly. I do think... I'm gonna get some more trade around here. Dread for get some more trade. I just want to get more trade all over the place, honestly. Just have everybody get more trade. Because these are so cheap. I love how all these buildings are so cheap. Although, uh, there's no trade going here right now, so there's no point to grab that. I'm surprised there's no trade going over here. It feels weird. I might actually just want to give you guys more growth. Um, let's just give you a better farm. Give you a better farm on that island there. Uh, Widow's Watch, more trade. Though, actually, the reels doesn't have any trade either, for some reason. So I'll give you guys more growth, I will say. Uh, Flint's Finger, I never built roads here for some reason. Okay. Uh, Bear Island, I didn't build roads for obvious reasons. But I can get some more trade for you guys there. Uh, more trade here. And then I think that's about it. Oh, never mind. I've never built roads down here either. Okay, that is it for all of you guys. I think, though, what we need to start doing is... I do need to finish off the... Uh, I do need to try and finish off the Night's Watch at some point, but also, I'm expecting a war to start soon with uh, the Free Folk, as uh, I'm not at war with them just yet. Uh, let's see, if we go to Essos, I want Unsullied all, then go kill the White Walkers. <laughs> we will be going to Essos at some point, for sure. Um, let's see, uh, Cosa Nostra, can I be a Dustin? Yes, you may be a Dustin. Uh, which Dustin do you want to be? Because I think we had one more Dustin. We had, uh, we only have Theon Dustin, he's the other Dustin, so I'll put you down as Theon Dustin Corsa. So. Um, oh, why did it disappear? Uh, so, Corsa. Co oh, okay, so yeah, Corsa. Uh, Corsa. Corsa. Nostra. I will put you down as Theon Dustin. There we go. Okay, I'll see. Uh, oh shit! 
Hope you're okay, Gabby. Let's see, I'm not interested in the new person army, but I just want my aim found modifier. <laughs> That's understandable. How old is John Glover? Uh, John Glover... I think he's like fucking 70 or something. Oh no, he's only 30. <laughs> Big difference there. Sorry, he's 31. He is 31. Um, so how about hiring me? Okay, let's see. I have currently... Let's see. As Torn Stock, I have 6,000. How about 2,000 dragons, uh, Dr. E, to have you help out in the war against the Free Folk? How about that? Is that, a, is that enough to satiate you to join on in? That's a game plan for today. Game plan for today is going to be trying to conquer um, all of the Free Folk, and we've been hearing tidings of things uh, going bump in the night up in the northwest, so we might be also trying to deal with the um, forces of the undead. So we might be trying to do that. I'll be basically having you two be the main areas we recruit units to try and send up Winter right now. Winter is I'll do as you command, my lord. Here, another watchtower. And we do have a general up here, we do. Yes, but I have, like, nobody up here to kind of watch over the area. Let's grab some, just in case. And then I think that should be it for that turn. Good morning! Made it to the stream! hey oh, kill subscribe! Let's see, okay, Ram, can you, um... Can you train an army for my character, uh, Jojen Reed, whenever you can? Let's see, are there any House uh, Rizwell custom units? I believe so. I believe there are. Um, I need to just find which area is attached to them again. Because, um, let's see. Because literally every hold pretty much has custom units. So we have... I think it's yeah, just the, the Rills remembers. is what you guys are technically... Yeah, you've got Riz, uh, Ricewell Axemen. So you guys have those. Um, I think they have it for there. Is there any other cities that technically have that? No, I think it's just the one. I think it's yeah, just just that one that has those. The North remembers. But no, every house pretty much has custom uh, units for the most part. They're basically just a recolor for the most part. And uh, well, you know, some of the actual visuals do look different, but for the most part, they are very similar. There we go. A lot of marketplaces are built up. Okay, now I need to keep sending all of these guys forward. The North remembers. Let's grab Winter all of is coming. you. Keep bringing more forces up to Castle Black. Because we're going to have to continuously keep bringing forces up here. As we shall now man the wall. So as the, the uh, traitorous wall. Knights Watch have to still be dealt with. Again, I'm hoping that eventually I'll be able to... Like, if I could technically destroy this and build it back up, um, I would do so. And I think that would actually give me access to their units, I think. Um, but at the moment, it's not really working that way as much as I would want. Let's see, are there, and I read that part, let's see, uh, he's going to be my daddy, but <laughs> sure, 2,000 dragons is enough for me. Alrighty, I will do so. Um, yes, there are several free generals, uh, several. Um, if you specify a house, um, we can check for specifically based on that first, on who is still uh, claimed and who has not been claimed. So we have the Starks, Manderleys, Glovers, Mormons, Umba, um, both, both, no, oh, there's one more Flint, no Dustins, uh, no Talharts, no, uh, nobody's taken a lock. Uh, we have one more Carowin, we've got, uh, I think all the Ricewells. Magnar Wolves and Wolfields down here, nobody's selected those guys just yet. Okay, Dr. E, I will give you 2,000 Dragons to join in the war for today. Uh, let's see, Dr. E, where did you go? Dr. E's way down there. So I'll give Dr. E some more money to join the war effort for today. I'm going to remind myself which character Dr. E is specifically again. Dr. E is uh, Martin Mormont. Oh, yeah, okay, so yeah, you're you're already up here. You're already, uh, no, actually, no, it's the... Where the hell did Mormon, that Mormont go? Uh, Martin Mormont. Oh, no, you're still on, uh, you're still on Bear Iron. Okay. So then we can bring you over, actually. So we'll have it so... Let's see, you've got two commands. So I'll make sure you come with at least two units that will be your own personal bodyguard um, that are part of your army. So I'll have it so that I'll give you a, a swordsman and a longbowman, and then those will be the units that kind of come along with you. Brandon Stock, I'm going to bring you back over towards I'll Winterfell. Command, my lord. I'm a man of my word. Uh, what did I miss? Uh, Ryan Neely, uh, so far all we've been doing is we've been bringing some more forces up towards the wall. Um, we are going to be trying to push in along up, the, up north today. Trying to deal with and conquer the free peoples. Also, where is my here? He is. So I need to start kind of exploring around here. Start trying to scout out the areas, see where all the free folks' land is, because we are going to be trying to conquer them all. Um, oh, actually, yeah, I will leave you guys as free upkeep around here. How many free upkeep slots are there? One from that. 
We have two free upkeep slots. Okay. I think for around here, you guys... I, I'm probably going to keep recruiting the, the, the cannibals around here. Oh, they, they only take one... Oh, these are... Oh my god, these are cheap as shit. <laughs> oh my god, they are so cheap. Huh. Okay. Sure. Um, We're going to use them as fodder. And actually, we'll have the wild... One of the wildlings man the walls, I feel like, because they're so cheap. Why not? The cavalry's arrived, my king. I see the monastery money uh, should be wolves or something related to the uh, Stark House since Aegon has not conquered the Seven Kingdoms yet. True. Um, I initially just set it up as dragons because in-game that's what they're still called, technically. So I'm just going off that since it's technically easier. But technically we should have it be something else. But I think we'll probably just keep it as dragons. As also, dragons just kind of sounds cool. That, that's at least my viewpoint on it. Uh, let's keep getting more trade. Oh, actually, White Harbor. Um, so that gives us more trade goods there. Oh, we're now getting 300 per. Ooh, yes. Ooh, yes. I can't, I think we might almost get uh, White Harbor to 10,000 uh, income this video. I would love if Winter we did that. Also, the North remembers. Yeah, you guys. I'll move you up over here. I think word. next turn... I won't disappoint you. Let's go finish off the Night's Watch, because I'm not at war with the Free Folk just yet. Uh, I do think... Honestly, I'm probably going to just keep recruiting these guys, just keep recruiting the Wildlings, because they're so fucking cheap. They have an upkeep of 20. Like, what the hell is this shit? Um, and have them kind of garrison the uh, the wall for us, because they're just cheaper. <laughs> just do that for us. I understand. Let's see, send me over there. I need to remind myself of Mormigale's character again. Mormigale specifically. Oh yeah, down all of Tall Heart. Tall heart. Okay, I can try to do that. See, I find it funny how my character is a uh, Leicester, a house that's I'm way too south of, uh, of the Starks. I, won't disappoint you. I think it makes sense though, um, especially since you're a maester. Uh, summer has returned, indeed. Now this is the perfect time for us to properly start trying to expand northward. So again, Winter I'm gonna have it so. Let's say if you guys go back down here, Lord. we'll have the wildlings man Winter the walls, is, just because they're so cheap. Lord. That way, I can actually use my good units up here. Um, let's have it so we'll leave those two behind. I'm Move out man. of here, the uh, and then right now. One, two, three, four, five. Actually, uh, do you all Lord. still have just infantry? Always I think they do. Get Ilige, Lord, uh, I can't get close enough to them to see them with this outrider, but I'm pretty sure. That they still have just a bunch of infantry. If they have just the a bunch North of infantry, I'll oh, actually let's, 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 let's send an archer North and an infantry unit. So if you guys kind of keep gathered around in Winter White Tree. But yeah, I'll next turn I'm gonna have uh, Jory Hornwood make his way I'll over and try I'll... and uh, get rid of the Night's Watch once and for all, or at least the lords of it, because the Night's Watch can't die. They are a faction that physically cannot die. Oh, well. uh, what is my character's stat? Stonewalker. Let me see. So Stonewalker. I need to remind myself which one I just gave you. And then we can kind of look at what your stuff is. So you are Roderick Flint. So you're the 70-year-old man. So down here. Roderick Flint. Let's see. He is Lord of House Flint. He's got some hard leather on him. Um, he's got a wolf pup as well. I love how everybody's a wolf pup. Uh, member of House Flint. Uh, he's a sense of justice. Trustworthy. Loyal. He is a competent, incompetent commander. Superb ad uh, administrator. Politically wise. Feels respected. Healthy supply lines, and that is all. So he's got a lot of loyalty, decent amount of chivalry, but no command whatsoever. Winter is More coming. Finally, we're as far south as we've ever been. We can now almost Making see the net, the twins. So you'll keep trying to get uh, give our watchtowers around here. And then, is there anything else I want to grab? Let's see. Those areas still. Oh no, Torrens Square and Barrowton. You can grab some more stuff around here. I'm gonna have you grab the windmill and Torrens Square. I'll grab the marketplace for right now, and then basically, um, Dreadfort, I'll have you grab, yeah, grab the Carpenter's Quarters, because, yeah, that's starting to improve a lot more now, now that we have trade all over the place, yeah. Winter okay. is coming. Let's have you get another watchtower do down here, you're you almost done with this Lord. area, I think one more watchtower down there will be you. pretty good. I'd do it again if I had the chance. Let's see. Hire all the wildlings and use them as the front line. <laughs> if they want to show their subservience, that they will die for their lords. What are my stats? Uh, Dr. E, let me go back over to your character. So, for Dr. E, you are a member of House Momont, promising commander, confident defender, very loyal, sociable, 
you feel appreciated. You are dauntless, sense of justice, champion fighter. Ooh, nice. Uh, healthy supply lines. And then you are commander of the north. That's actually really, that's a really good uh, trait there. That's a really good one. Uh, other than that, let's see what else we got going. I see, that's why the undead were so rich. The cost of is so low. Um, Ram, do you think you can raise my character's command? I can try to, Yabby. Um, it feels like it's actually pretty difficult. Oh, we had another Stark uh, be born. Um, it feels like it's actually kind of difficult to raise command in this mod, because I actually had Winter a pretty good coming. fight Winter with um, Patrick Robinson's remembers. character here, and he's still only at four command, so it might be difficult to increase command in this mod, which is kind of interesting if it is. is let's see, let's keep making you guys up this way. And again, keep recruiting the wildlings. Keep endlessly recruiting these guys. I'm going to love that they are so cheap, and that'll be great for fodder. Because uh, I want to send some over here as well to watch over East Watch so we can actually move out uh, Dominic Mandalay out of here. Although I don't know if Gabe actually wants this character to continue fighting just right now. Oh, there's another family member. I'll definitely have you guys kill them off once I move that guy out. Actually, I can probably just do that now. Uh, like, let's see behind you for a second. And then I can just make sure I kill you. That way there are no more of you guys around here. And then I think, can you guys be good without anybody in here? Yeah, you are. You're fine. Okay, so you guys go over there next turn. I'm going to start bringing you guys up this way um, to try and help out up north. Let's see, can I be a house wolf? Um, technically, you'll be of the house that you joined. Um, it's a little awkward if we try and make new houses, but uh, I don't know if that will work as well in this campaign as we have in the other castle, in the other one. Uh, hey Ram, can I be sent to Castle Black? Field Fighter, yes you can be. I just need to remind myself who you are specifically in game again. So Field Fighter, you are Jojen Reed. Yep, I can send you to Castle Black. So Jojen Reed, where is he on the map? He is currently here. So you're a gr uh, Water Watch. Oh man, you are really far away. Winter is coming. The hell is this? Oh, Craig -O man. Oh man, that face. Oh, that face. Man, so many people can use um, stakes, and I kind of love it. Yeah, so let's, let's send you up this way, send you towards Castle Black. It's going to take you a while, but I can try and send you up here. Let's see, any free characters? There are plenty of free characters, Dara Halpin. Uh, just specify a house, and we can look at who's available still. Because we've got the Starks, we've got the Mandalays, we've got the Glovers, we've got the Mormons, we've got the Umbers, we've got the Flints, we've got the Dustins. Actually, no, Dustins are all taken, Talhart's are all taken. Um... Locks, we've got the Carowinds, uh, Ricewells, we've got Magnar, Wool, and Woolfield. There's a lot of them there. Let's see, I need uh, combat in his own bones. Uh, let's see, I don't know, can, can I pay you to build me an army because I want to go south to the Riverlands and kick some badass? Um, on Watch Hydra, I believe I was... Yeah, I, I am building your army right now. I'm already recruiting your army right now. Because um, I, I don't know if you missed it on Watch Hydro, but... At the moment, what I'm going to say is four, um, four cell swords. I will make sure you have at least up to your command in units of your uh, house that are your own personal guard. After that, then it's like you have to gather troops from the other areas to field in your armies. Command, That's kind of how I'm at least doing it right now. Let's see. Uh, I see all of our commanders are uh, part of the canine cult. I feel like if anyone should have an ancillary um, commander of the north, it should be Jory Hornwood. Um, Ram, can I be um, a Bolton? Um, I think you get them if you recruit a Bolton bodyguard. Um, I can try and do that. Uh, we'll have to see if it'll let me... I'll have to see if I can actually recruit a Bolton bodyguard. I don't know if I can. I think I only recruit Stark bodyguards. I think. But I can try and see if we can do that, but we have to wait until we get access to... Um, we, we, can have, we can actually recruit that unit. But I believe I can only recruit Stark bodyguards, I think. But if I can, Ryan uh, Neely, I will try and let you become a Bolton. Even if that might be dangerous for your health, as we have someone that is uh, like RP that like they're trying to murder all Boltons. But we can try that. Let's see. Uh, the Jujun review might be made into Jujun based. Uh, an Umber or a Mandalay would suffice. I don't really care which of the two I am. Alrighty, do it all. Uh, sorry, I missed that. Let's see. So, what towns to the north are still available to be taken? Um, at the moment, at least land that we own. 
we, uh, at least on the map, that uh, everybody has... All the land that's currently available has been bought. Technically. Um, north of the wall, we have to conquer more land. Like, uh, I know we're going to be trying to finish off the Night's Watch after this next turn end. And then we'll be going probably for Hard Home next, honestly. We're still trying to scout out. Let's see. Send me with the Dustins beyond the wall, Ramp. I will try and do so, Joshua Bow and Fogarty. Everybody just wants to go up north. Just everybody wants to go north of the wall. Uh, how about House Stark? Um, the, I, I'll have to double check who we have for the Stark, so let's see. Because right now, Torin Stark, Brandon Stark, Carlin Stark. And then we have Osiris Stark. I thought there was one more Stark. Rickard is dead. So the only Starks that are of age um, are all taken. There is also Donor Stark. Donor Stark is also another character that will come of age relatively soonish. But that's the only other Stark we have. It's just Donor. Yeah, that's the only one we have at the moment if anybody wants to be a Stark. Let's see, I must rebuild the Night's Watch. Indeed. Let's see, so yeah, let me try and see. So, uh, Joshua Bonfagarty, you were again, um, you were Theo. You were the Theo. So you're the one that's currently in here, right? No, that's Theo. The North remembers. Well. Where the fuck happened you? There you are. So Winter I'll send you also. Basically, I'm going to have all these guys just I'll group up at mind, Castle Black. Do what's best. Because we have that, and then we had, let's see, so Ben Price wants to be that. Oh, I'm, I'm kind of fine behind. Let's see. So how about doing a, a tug of war and looking at the rest of Westeros? I will definitely do that, Merrick, at some point. Um, let me first try and figure out all the character stuff, and then I will try and keep checking on the map occasionally to see kind of how the world is uh, changing. Let's see. I could have uh, been a snow raised by the Starks. Um, also, since the RP never happened with the last series, could I try it in this series instead? Ah, uh, yes, you can technically try and do that, Dura. And then, Dura, you said you wanted to be an Umber or a Manderly? So if you want to be an, a Manderly, currently... The North remembers! Oh, I'll say Umber, because I know... We don't have a lot of Umbers. The North remembers! So, at the moment, there's Ethan Umber, and then I don't think... Now, Darren Umber has been taken. So all of you be John Umber. Winter is coming! All, uh, all of you be uh, John Umber, Dura. So, Dura. And then I'll have you be John Umber. There we go. So you can be John Umber there. You're currently the ones kind of walking about building watchtowers around here. I won't disappoint you. That's the first time I see you live. I love your Total War content. Keep it up. Thanks, man. Thanks, Tony Grimm. Good to hear that, man. That's the I call Dibs and Artem. That's the I, Lord Cameron, would love to lead a grand expedition south. Of course. I think for the moment right now, a lot of our attention is north, so we will not be putting a lot of attention south just yet. But, I will make sure that anybody that wants to be the First Lords expanding southward will gladly be given the opportunity the to do so. Members. I do Making think we are just going to be focusing on finishing off the, the uh, Free Folk Making first. Pardon, so you need to get like, one more watchtower over here. We almost have everything lit up here. Best. What's your bodyguard in this unit? Doran Wood. Oh, you have a Mountain Champions bodyguard unit. Interesting. Uh, and then I saw... Oh, it's Ben Price. Ben Price wants to be, I believe, Donor Stark. So I will put you as Donor Stark. You won't come of age just yet. Oh, thank you. St thank you for actually putting that on there yourself. Perfect. Be all of you be uh, Donor Stark. And Dan Price. Ben Price, sorry. Perfect. Let's see. I would not like to go north, but to the east and conquer in the name of the north. Alrighty. Also, just in case, guys, uh, because there's a lot of comments going on occasionally, I might accidentally forget something that's been said in chat because there's a lot of you. Um, if you guys have specific things you want to do in the campaign, feel free to put that in the Excel sheet because I do have a tasks column. So you can say, oh, hey, I want to, yeah, I want to go conquer East. Put that down and that'll kind of remind me, oh, you want to go conquer East so I can remember to do that whenever we're getting to that point. Uh, John Ember is taken uh, by Red One, I'm pretty sure. I thought John Ember wasn't taken. Oh, shit, John Ember is taken. Um, so then the only other Umber then actually is the other guy. So I'll actually put Dura... The only other Umber is Ethan. Ethan Umber. Sorry. I missed it up. So Ethan Umber is the only other Umber. Okay. There we go. 
I'll see. Ram, can I tax people to go north of the wall since I own Castle Black? Hmm. Technically, yes. Technically, yes. So, can I either be uh, an Umber or a Manderly? Uh, well, at the moment, uh, that would be the last Umber that was just available there. Now, if you want to be a Manderly, that would be uh, Ethan Manderly. So, I can put you down as him, so. So, so. Uh, uh, yes, I'll put. Oh, actually, that's. I mixed up the S and the A at the end there. Boom, boom, and then I'll put you down as Ethan Manderley. So you are now uh, Gabe's son, I believe. And I believe that uh, we will... Oh, not Mansley. Manderley. Manderley, I say. There we go, Manderley. Ethan Manderley. Perfect. Okay. Uh, Rampant, someone else was already John Umber. Yep, we already we have already fixed that now at this point now. Perfectly. Okay. Um, on that, let's see. I'm just gonna go through these other things, and then we have a fight. I bet I right here. Let's see. When night falls, the watches of the wall shall protect the north and the south. Uh, Ram, can you bet on land before it's owned? No, you cannot bet on land before it is owned. We have to. Oh, what the fuck? Who the fuck are these guys? Also, the game's about to crash. <laughs> um. Seriously, who the hell are you guys? Why do I have these generals Winter here? Winter is coming. Who the fuck are you? <laughs> why are you controlling my- what? Why do I have these guys? Oh, is it just you're fucked up? What the hell? Why? What is this? What is your retinue? A boar. Okay, so the game's not gonna crash. I thought it was gonna crash for a second, but no, you have a boar. What the fuck? <laughs> the North remembers! Are some of these units just generals? I'm gonna test it. If you two become generals, then yeah. Winter is coming. I'm a man of Winter That's weird as fuck. Remembers. Okay. But yeah, keep uh keep going back here, guys. The North remembers. Mandalays, I'll have you come up with these uh, reinforcements. Winter is, Winter is coming. Like, let's go up right here. The North and remembers. then uh, you guys group up with us. I can't merge any of you guys. But we've got a fight here the with uh, the Mormons. I'll have it so that you attack the. Actually, no, to detect the armor, Roger Army. Fight. Oh my god, they have skirmishers for once! So I'm not going to just slaughter the entire Okay, they have those two skirmishers. Joy Horn, what's got Our this? House will never fall. Damn, that's a big ass port. Um, let's see, Dura, can I invade Bravos? Yes, you may certainly can. Uh, after my army is finished recruiting, can you send me near Mokalen on my way? There's going to be reinforcements from Rice Will and House Dustin. I just don't want to be used to Stark Stats. Okay, that's fine. Again, just remind me to do that Like once we're getting closer. Um, why do you have Rivermen? Um, at the moment, I'm not sure actually why we do... Oh, what the fuck? Well, I guess we are attacking near the wall. Um, how is this fair? So he can't go up here. He shouldn't be able to go, actually. He might be able to walk up here. No. Uh, is it traversable up there? Oh my god, that wall might be fucking traversable. Um, okay, I'm gonna back up. Because this might be very unfair. Um, the reinforcements technically should be coming from over here. I don't think I can fucking fight these guys, actually. Just given the location of their armies, I don't think I can fight them. So let me go over here, let me check. I have to see. If, they, if they're on the wall, like on top of the fucking wall, I can't fight them. Okay. The enemy are bringing in okay. They can't spawn on top of the fucking wall. Thank you. That would have been a problem. Uh, how do you have a blackboard? I guess I might just woke up. What did I miss? You got some wild units. Yeah, I do have the wild units. Let's see, the North Shaw, for your colonial empire lands, some SOs for how stark winter is coming. Uh, that one general was always saying winter is coming, like, no shit, we're gonna fight the need to stop. Uh, Ram, can you send, uh, send me the Knights to watch territory? Yes, I can. Again, just 
I, I will not be able to remember all this crap while we're oh, I'm doing a battle. So if you guys have things like that, just please remember to just let me know in the Excel sheet to like write that down. Or once I'm out of the battle, then I can make sure to try and do that kind of stuff. So let's see, let's move my infantry here and here. You guys want to have guard mode on. All of you guys want to have skirmish mode off. And then my cavalry. So we need to kill... Oh, he's actually... Oh, he's one of the generals too this time. Okay. For the most part, we should still be fine. Because again, most of the units are infantry. That general's also running on over this way. So let's get my cab to kind of run over here. Let's get everybody to rush into position. Because they're running the cab over here pretty quickly. So kind of pull back, guys. It's set up. Yeah, they've got one of their generals just right in front of us. I'm hoping my archers can open up on him, please. Let's see. Uh, I would like to invade the Veil, please. Did I die yet? No, you're not dead yet. Uh, uh, Wildling Warriors are General's Bodyguard, I think. I just find that interesting that they I can easily recruit so many of those guys. Which is kind of fascinating. Okay, I'm actually going to have my infantry kind of adjust a little bit more. Kind of more like so. Uh, I'm going to have some of my archers adjust for a second. Get a little bit closer over here. Because they're just grouping up right here. Number-wise, they've lost about 2% of the forces so far. They're not advancing on us just yet. But they are starting to adjust. My cap, I'm going to have you kind of over to the side here. So far, they haven't started to advance on us just yet. But my archers, if you're going to shoot anybody, shoot that uh, the Night's Watch Brothers, this heavy cab unit. We need to kill the general as quickly as possible. As soon as he dies, if you can't shoot him from where you're at, just don't. We have to kill them as soon as possible. Let's see, make sure to never touch a stone myth. Uh, also, what did I miss in the campaign so far? Um, literally, we haven't done a whole lot. Besides just, oh hey, we're moving up. Uh, we're now properly finishing off the Night's Watch here. Uh, we've done some recruiting, some building, and that's about it so far. Um, Cap, let's kind of get you guys to run it back around here. I'm going to try and charge into them immediately right now. And then archers again. Try and shoot the General's Bodyguard. So this Night's Watch Brothers is the unit we want to try and kill and focus on. Although, if you can't shoot him from where you're at... Actually, have you guys just pick your own targets right now. My melee cab. Let's have you guys try and hit these guys back here. If you can. Try and break the builders. There's only a couple of them. Try and get to those archers of theirs. Oh man, our charges can do a lot of damage. Okay, pull back a little bit here, guys. 7 to 15 so far. Not the worst. Jones Bodyguard is winning over there. I do not like to see that. I'm going to have it so... Let's try and have it so... Let's, you go over to the side a little bit more... Up the side a little bit more here. We're gonna charge the spearman. The oh, this... King lies dead, oh, he's dead already. By our okay, perfect for me. Attack while his men mourn the loss. Also, how do we get money in this ga uh, campaign? Uh, it's the same way as with previous campaigns: owning land or being a certain type of uh, like profession or job gets you a little bit more, or guild kind of association uh, gives you more money. Uh, as kind of in the past. So, like, for example, Patrick Robinson's character right here, Jory Hornwood, is a sellsword. Sellswords get more money based on them, um, based on Our their command. The so battle. the more command Only he has, the more money he makes. Remains. And the more of a personal army he can have with him. 41. That. Oh, those guys aren't breaking. Oh, that's the cab unit. That's the cab unit. Pull back from that. Pull back over here. I don't think these guys can run away, so I don't think I have to actually focus on chasing them down for the most part. These ranges are okay to deal with. Just ignore them for the most part. The other enemy general is way back here, I believe. Yeah, he's the other mounted bodyguard, too. Damn. Let's see. Uh, who will lead the council of late, uh, later? Because Janie and Gilbert have to score tomorrow. Um. Destroyer's not here. I've kind of been trusting Destroyer to lead the council as well. I mean, um... else would I trust leading the council? Because, again, I won't be able to lead the council for today, because we do have, um... I mean, I do have D&D after it. Let's see, over on Twitch side, let's see. Uh, cash... Is Night's Watch AI defensive passive, so it doesn't expand on map or accuracy? And diplomatically, are they set to neutral or allied with all other houses? Um, they are set to... They're pretty passive on the campaign map. 
um, and they are set to neutral with, or they are set to allied with most of the um, houses of Westeros. Although, actually, I think initially they're only allied with the north um, because of the time period we're in. I think if you do a different scenario, they actually have, um, they're allied with everybody, I think. Okay, I think we now just need to keep running down, or run all these guys down. Then we need to adjust and focus on their reinforcements. Because at this point, it's just this army over here that's left. So, let's keep bringing my generals over to help out with you guys. It's hard to see with the trees who is running and who is not. Let's go so far. Okay, so bring over these guys to here. Those are all broken. Oh, they're actually attacking me. Ah, uh, that is the, the cannon. Is very much I don't have a lot of ever. infantry, so I can't send anybody over, fast, really. But I can have you guys try and hours. focus them down. Try and focus this unit. My cab is making their way over here, so I can focus them in a second. Let's see, how do I get money, and can I build my lands the way I want? Um, yes, Stonewalker. What you can do, Stonewalker, is, again, the main ways to make money for this campaign for your character is owning land. So, when we conquer new lands, you can, um, you can have a bid to say, hey, I want to control this land. Um, you can also have a profession. So, for example, sell swords. Again, I've already gone over how sell swords make money. There's also merchants. You can be a merchant and say, hey, I want to try and invest in lands and try and trade. That is another way to own, make more money, because that way you don't have to own the land to invest in it as a merchant. Um, I have a, a bunch of, I have a list on my Discord. Um, it's under the, it's in the, it's in the council channel. I have pinned information there on all the RP stuff that we do. And that will kind of, that details uh, the different professions on how to make money. Stonewalker, I'd like to be a merchant. The All right, I can put you down as a merchant right here because I If we remain true and so steadfast, put you as a merchant. will be ours. Look how our cowardly foe so You are now a merchant, Stonewalker. You can either be, attack. technically, I have it so merchants and um, craftsmen are the same thing. So you can say, hey, oh, I'm a craftsman. I, can, I have this kind of trade, um, as opposed to specifically just only trading money. So you can kind of do a little bit of both. And also, they've got, like, nobody over here, so let's just have my infantry try and help kill this general. Try and help kill him, because once this general's bodyguard's out of the way, then we've pretty much got this battle here. He's already losing that fight. Let's see, no, it's okay. Let's see, uh, I can lead the council. Um, let's see. How much have I seen field fighter do well in the army? Um, I can almost maybe see field fighter. Uh, I could lead the council if I trust me around. I, 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 will, I will trust Patrick Robinson. Patrick Robinson, I know, will do a good job leading the, um, leading the council. Uh, who died? Uh, the enemy general. Let's see, uh, can I be a blacksmith? Yes, you can. You can be a blacksmith. So I can say instead of, uh, merchant, um, so it's, so you are, I'll put it down as craftsman, craftsman on the, uh, Excel sheet, but then in a comment, you are technically a good blacksmith. tidings. The enemy general lies dead. Nice. We have sent the cart to there hell. So you can almost actually like play this off as, oh, hey, I'm like I craft Valyrian steel or something like that. That is something you can technically argue and say that you do. Okay, so those guys are now just trying to run away. They're not gonna be able to get away from us. Um, is that it? I think that's the, uh, the entire enemy army. There's like nobody left. They've got guys on the side of the map here who up oh, there we go. We're gonna end the battle there. This is a clear Because that should kill them off. I don't believe I had to chase them down to battle. finish them off properly. But there we go. Let's see, I feel like mine and Hydro just hate the princes in general because they're so selfish and stubborn. Uh, oh my god, I thought I died. <laughs> Thankfully no. Okay, I just tried to do uh, why would they both have to name Jory Dang it? Uh, and Smith. Uh Hydro. Let's see, I'll pay for your sword, you sir. I wonder if there are just random Valyrian swords, uh, ancillaries that you can grab. That'd be kind of cool if there was, because then if, like, I found that there was an actual trait like that, I could just give out Valyrian steel swords to people. That's right, your two sons can't help but argue with each other. Carlin can't stop trying to claim he uh, defeated House Bolton single-handedly. Ah, yes, such young blooded stocks. They'll get over it eventually. <laughs> eventually they'll stop bickering and bitching at each other and be a bit more temperate. But at the moment, no, they're hot-blooded. Hot Let's see, the horror of this mod looks interesting. <laughs> I 
God damn it, the game fucking crashed. Yep, saying that as soon as it crashes. God damn it. It is a bit unstable. Fuck. Okay, we won that fight though, so I'll just use the auto win sheet there. God damn it. It isn't as, like, I... Yep, as soon as that's brought up, we do, we just want to don't let the game know that we're admiring it, and, and if we do, it will then crash to try and prove us wrong. So are we just going to try and keep track of how many crashes we've had just in general, or are we just going to keep it for... It seems like now everybody just wants to make a counter for how many crashes we've just had in general. You know, it's funny that uh, Janie and Gilbert are siblings in RP and in real life. Oh, yeah. I kind of wish it had mod support on Steam. It would make it a lot easier. It, it would be a, a lot more simple if we could just have, like, a Steam Workshop for Medieval 2 on Steam. I hope, and I kind of expect this, that if we ever have it so that we do, uh, if they get a War at Medieval 2 remastered, I, I could easily see us have a Steam, a Steam Workshop uh, uh, support. Let's see, have you played Game of Thrones mod on Mountain Blade? Uh, was interesting, too. Um, for Mountain Blade Warband, yes. I've played the version on that. I have not played the Banner War version um, that is Game of Thrones mod just yet. But I know I want to at some point. Uh, let's see, they're already claiming that they're going to duel. I'll make fine swords and axes, etc. Even though they only led one battle, well, it's kind of the axe like he only did. Um, yeah, the Banner Lords one is amazing. Yeah, original Mountain Blade. Yeah, because I, I know I've, I played that one. I remember I tried playing, and I was trying to help... Uh, I think I was trying to help Stannis at the time. I was trying to help no Stannis the Manus. But yeah, I'm going to have you I guys... We, we, we won this fight. Um, so we will just use the auto-win attacker cheat here. Do slaughter these guys. Wow, that's overpowered, but sure. Our house there we go. Fall. So, that is pretty much all of the armies of the Night's Watch. Winter is coming. They, they can't, they, they won't die. They won't straight up die. There's one of the factions that just don't, doesn't die. But now that they're out of the way, we can now properly start trying to focus on there. specifically the free folk you. now. Um, so I think what we're probably going to be doing is we're first going to focus on... Also, if you guys have... Yeah, if your units are just these, then that is going to be so easy to slaughter you guys. Also, technically if we want... Uh, we now have far more ways to get generals if, like, I don't... I'm gonna test this and see if they are, but I think we just have an endless way to just recruit troops now. Uh, which is Wait, interesting. Oh, hey, there's another way. reed here! Also, I'm gonna use you guys like fodder. Like, honestly, I'm gonna use these guys like fodder. I don't want them to actually be governors and generals, but if people want to be generals, I and mean, we can just get different names Winter for them, why not? It's another way to get new characters, at least, on the map. Uh, other than that, though, I think... For right now, at least. You don't have enough movement, but I can move you a little bit more to the east. Um, my Outrider. So let's see, so we found the Fist of the First Men. So we found that area now. You keep exploring. They've got a lot of land around here that they have. Um, may I be a merchant? Uh, Sal, yes, you may be a merchant as well. So I'll put you down as a merchant. Merchant. There you go. Um, what's also going on in the Let's see, is this the most unstable Game of Thrones mod from Medieval 2? Um, it's in the running for it. It is in the running for it, because actually at the moment, uh, this mod and I'd say the unofficial patch for uh, the Elder Scrolls Total War mod are currently in the running for the most unstable mods I've ever played for Medieval 2. But in, the, but in some regard, they're also actually kind of endearing because uh, of what they try and change. But they are still uh, buggy and crashy as shit. Doesn't stop me from enjoying them and loving them, though. Let me get some more kennels around here. But I think that should be it for that. Let's see, what's the difference is this to other Game of Thrones mods from Evil 2? The main difference um, is this one has Essos. Actually, let me do showcase that now. We can just kind of showcase the map a little bit more. So this map has not only Westeros, but it also has Essos. It also has Essos on the map, just all of it. But it also, instead of, uh, besides just that, it also has many different um, scenarios. You can have, this is Aegon's Conquest, you can do the Dance of Dragons scenario. They also have Robert's Rebellion, they've got the War of Five Kings. Um, they've got multiple different um, is coming. scenarios that you can go through. That's like the main difference. Also there's dragons. There's like actual dragons. Is that the new TV series? Yeah, that's actually, that's the one too. You can, that is one scenario that is available there as well. 
Uh, Gabe, where did my army go? Uh, Gabe, your army right now is right eh, eh, here. Your army is right here, Gabe. Ozzy Ram, remember me to send me over there? I think I am more McGill. I think, yeah, Donald Tallhart. Oh, yeah, I, no, Donald Tallhart is not moving just yet. So, Donald Tallhart. Winter is coming. I'll start making you move up towards Castle Black as well. I will do it. Everybody wants to go over on. there. I'll do what's best. So, do you get Knights of Watch units? Um, at the moment, no. I changed the code and it still is not giving me any of them for some reason, so I don't think I'm going to be able to, sadly. George Farm is just taking us taking names. Um, let's see, it has custom maps, buildings like the Iron Bank. Um, it does have some custom buildings, yes. Um, also, it does have some custom maps, like we had uh, Dreadfort had a custom map. It does have some custom buildings as well. I thought I saw some... Like, there's... Yeah, there's like this. There, well, there's slowly... Uh, it's still somewhat operating some of the things, but like, for example, yeah, co uh, Gold Cook Barracks, they do have these unique buildings. They need to update some of the stuff, but there's like, hey, a Dragonstone Mine, um, there was, where was it? Uh, oh! Oh, just a Steel Smithy weapon. That's cool. But, you know, it does have quite, it has a lot of stuff that you can build. There's a Volantis Temple here. Yeah, no, it oh! Ooh! Uh, where the fuck is this built up? Yeah, so it does have some unique buildings that actually has unique units on them, too. Cool! I didn't even notice that. That's kind of awesome. Okay, interesting to see during battle. Yes, indeed. Uh, I had one other stream that's currently... Uh, it's on my YouTube channel, uh, Cash Moose uh, is Studios. Uh, it's, uh, make sure I'm... Cash me... Uh, oh, that... Fuck, that's what it says. Cash me outside Studios. That's what it is. Um, yeah, I've, I've got the vlog on my YouTube channel, and uh, that showcases our fight for the Dreadfort. It's a little bit of an awkward proportions, which is just kind of hilarious, honestly. Let's see, someone become him and we can be brothers. Uh, why do we keep starting campaigns that keep crashing? Well, we keep picking the interesting campaigns, so they have to crash to make them interesting. Of course. That's why. That's obviously why. Let's see, uh, Graham, can you send me to Caitlin? Yes, I can, Gabby. Let me make sure I remind myself which character you are again. So Gabby's character is Darren Umber. Darren Umber? And technically... This game is more stable because I did something. Um, so you'll be on the wall. The so I, I'll have it so yeah, you'll, you, you've had enough of your fill here, Darren Umber. I will have you make your way back down towards Mo Kaelin. I will do what command you're command Umber, Lord. so do you want to have some Umber units along with you when you're going back down south? Because you can try and have you do that. So I can have you maybe stop in uh, Last Earth first to do so, but then we can just try and make sure. Yep, these are just all generals. Okay, we're gonna get. I'm gonna treat you like fodder. Uh, first, let's have you guys go over there. But yeah, let's have uh, all of these guys kind of follow us along. These guys are all gonna be fodder. I'm not gonna care if I get them killed. They're just uh, wildling fodder. He's got a Tarth. This is random. They're so random. I love it. Okay, but we are going to keep pushing over this way. Let's get another watchtower right command, here. Hey, oh, crazy Dutchman. How is it going, my man? Let's see. Uh, my character sounds posh. Uh, Ram, can you send me to Mokalen with my army now, please? Um, is your army now done? Yes. Winter is so coming. all of you get out of deep wood moss. Actually, I'm going to see if you push these guys back first. Your so it's you, you, and get these guys. So this is your army, and then I'll have it so that uh, John Glover, as soon as he's done building watchtowers, he'll go back and watch over the city there. But I will start sending you down towards Mort Kalem. It's going to take you a while, but I will start sending you down that way. Uh, don't you have to change export um, and yes. I changed the description buildings, did I not change the description unit ownership? That actually might be what I forgot to do. Um, gotta say, I love how me and the other person with the Mormon both want to take Iron Islands. Uh, did you build farms in White Harbor? Uh, not yet, Gabe, but actually, what I was trying to say, uh, or I, you missed this because you weren't here yet, Gabe. Um, the reason why I've been focusing so much on trade, Gabe, is because trade also grows the populace. So if we get enough trade, we don't have to worry as much. So like here, um, not enough. Like, actually, I think I'd have to, like, see. Eventually... If I get enough trade buildings, it just grows the populace. 
Actually, I think that's like almost all of our trade goods. Like, if I just queue up a bunch of trade buildings, you might see it again. So, like, all those. No, that wouldn't do it, but also. Oh, give me another level 100. <laughs> all the trade! I want all the trade! I'm just gonna queue those up. Those are gonna be built. Why not? Let's do that. Let's see. I'm doing mighty fine. I've got my first YouTube video with over 100 views now. So that's really improving my mood. Oh, nice! What kind of YouTube video did you crazy Dutchman? Let's see. Yeah, the Boltons uh, were such great at uh, stretching this torture that they had to make Dreadfort it be a giant proportions. Uh, just give me them as my cell sword army. Sure, Patrick Robinson. Their stats are shite. The wild though these Wait, units the are crap. Like their stats are horrendous. They are not going to last the whatsoever in any combat encounter at all. So, like, we can try doing that, but uh, I don't know if that's going to work out that well. Also, uh, I'm going to start moving you guys up this way. We're going to start making our way over to Pod Home. Also, I really should get some ships over here, uh, so we can actually easily bring our forces back around. I can't recruit a ship there. Here I can. Let's get a galley around here. We'll get a galley, and then we can try and have it so that those guys will be able to pick us back up from Hard Home, or actually kind of maybe send us more north, possibly. So we're still trying to find all the lands. Oh, there's Ruddy Hall. Uh, Hornfoot stand. Wow, you have a lot of armies. Oh, they've got giants. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Uh, javelins thrown before charge. All their other units are crap, but the giants. Oh god. Oh god. Okay, I'm gonna hope that we aren't gonna get ourselves fucked over here. That's my hope, at least. But, hey, as long as we've got some good umber men to help us out, honestly, we're gonna want a lot of archers. We're gonna want a lot of a lot of archers to help out there. Also, the reason why I'm prepping those guys there, I'd say. And let's go the chat. Has he arrived at Castle Black yet? Uh, not yet. Jojen Reed is gonna take a while to get there. He is still pretty far away um, from initially getting to us. Because... He was like, I think like seven turns away. Where'd he go? He's right here. So you're you're currently at the neck. You are really Winter far away. Coming. You're at the other, you have to literally cross the, the entirety of uh, the north to get to Castle Black. So you're gonna take a long time to get there. That's the Eskisi Islands video I've been uploading since July, which makes it even crazier. Oh, nice. I've always really enjoyed Sea Skylines. It's always a really fun game. I'm just really bad at it sometimes. Uh, when will I return to Invade the Veil? Um, I kind of wanted to have it so we took out the uh, Free Folk before we started Winter properly expanding down south. As I don't know why. Well, let me look at their military. The Free Folk. Even with all those armies, they don't actually have a lot. We could try and trust no, just members. Patrick Robinson with the expansion up this way. Winter and I can have you... like uh, let's, have, let's do this. I want you to take Hard Home, and then I can have it so we're already trying to get a ship around here. Um, this ship then can pick you up and try and bring you back down south. Also bring, bring those guys up there. I think for right now, Winter at least, I want to the try North and bring remembers. you over this way. Try and take Hard Home, at least. I won't disappoint then we can try and trust the northern expansion to just um, Patrick Robinson's character. Which, do as you command, my lord. At the moment, I should try and hit these guys I if I can. I am not able to. The North remember, the North remember. Yeah, you're making me down south. Winter is these guys will kind of just hold all of my reinforcements for the most the North part. Remembers. These guys. I will do as you will do as you you're going to be the reinforcements for the most part. Man of my word. So you the can North finally remembers. go over to Shadow Tower I'm a man of my and then bring word. these guys up as well. I will do as you command, my lord. I'd do it again if I had the chance. Um, and let's see. Uh, you never mind, just feed them to the wolves. <laughs> Uh, remember to give me reinforcements from House Risewell and House Dustin on my way down. I, I'll try to, um, Unwanted Hydro. Um, they're kind of a bit out of the way, but I can grab some. Because we can grab, let's grab a couple guys here. Grab, like, three of them there. These are Tallheart men. I'll grab at least three units of each. Or I'll try to grab three units of each. That way there's a little bit of a more, a more of an Winter army, um, for you there, Unwanted Hydro, as you make your way down. Uh, there's that, and then I do need to just keep moving the, the lava here. I will do as you command, the watchtower at least next turn. Uh, I do think we have to be careful though with our economy, as we're gonna be switching ourselves thin, guys. I'll do as you command, my lord. Don't remember the money you guys give me. I can't give myself until the next stream. 
Let's see. Uh, we are so I screwed understand. against them. This is completely crazy, but I do think that I can make Moat Kaelin into a military base by the time we attack south. Uh, for the army, for my army, I want to recruit men from Old Castle, White Harbor, and Ramsgate. Uh, I will take Come get it. You're All right. Busted. Yeah. Income wise, we are not making as much money as I would like right now. Uh, I'm going to keep just queuing up with just trade buildings around here. Ooh. Hey, this also gives growth. Costs 9,000, though. Wow. That's really expensive. But it might actually be a really nice improvement. Um, also, I need to keep making sure I grab any excess men and send them north. So, like, the north these Karstark Stark uh, spearmen, they need to command, go up Lord. north. I'll do uh, Winter is Umber. coming. Let's have you get another watchtower right I'm down here. I won't oh, the north is finally almost all lit up. Lord. Almost finally lit up. Uh, you never remembers. moved over here for some reason. Winter is coming. You're I'll supposed to make your way over there. And then John the Glover. Begging build some watchtowers the there, but it's long and the over here, man of my word. and I need like one I more over here, and then I just go back up pardon, north, fill it's up a lot of these other do. areas, and then I think that's it. Okay. Oh, I also forgot to move. Yes. Winter is coming. I'm a man of Because I, was, I, I convinced Doctor E to the make his way over as well, so I'll send him over towards Shadow Tower. Send him over to Shadow Tower, and he'll help out in the north for today. Winter is coming. You need to keep making your way up this way, and then let's see how this bad this is. I'm curious because like this army here. Winter is coming. We are going to attack these guys. They have no giants whatsoever. But again, this army, the chief unit is just... they're just what These units are shit. Like, they have a tiny amount of shield, but they have no armor. Defense is absolute dog shit. Oh, I think your stats actually went up for once. Come get it, you bastard. Nice. What's up, bitches? What did I miss? Um, agents, uh, you currently have? Uh, currently, I think the agents we have are currently only, we have one Meister, one Outrider, and one Merchant. I haven't recruited a lot of agents right now, for the most part. We've been kind of ignoring them just for the, uh, for right now. On that, let's see, I don't know who is older, me or my brother. Uh, Raymond, if I get an army, I will help out beyond the wall for free. All righty, field fighter. That's the other one, the two, let's see, he gets four plus, uh, one attacking. Is it up to plus, plus four now? He only had plus two before. All my archers. Scourge went off. You guys right there. And then my infantry. I do need to get another cab unit in this army, honestly. We're kind of a little bit low on cab, but still. We'll focus on the general. Because they're either going to advance on us, or they're just going to sit back here and do nothing. At the moment, they're doing nothing. So let's have my cab kind of push forward, try and kill their captain, and then make them make uh, their way over to us. Uh, do I finally have more command? Possibly. I'll have to double check, because I know you had one trait that gave you two more command when attacking, but you ha you gained more command than last time. Uh, Carl has shown himself to be selfish. He doesn't uh, like it when people... Uh, did you see the letters mean kill sent to each other? Yes. I tell you the only reason wild lanes are such a threat is because of their sheer numbers. That is the only reason at the moment. Like, if anything, like if I just compare the stats of my units, my units are so much better. Oh, so much better than their units. And also my uh, melee stats are just higher, so I can just slaughter their units too. My archers should make short work of them because they have no armor. These guys have no armor, so they should absolutely get slaughtered by skirmishers. At the moment, they're just chilling there. And yeah, the army's just a blob. They're literally just a blob here. Those are all the cannibals just chilling there. Okay, well, hopefully they just let me kill the captain really easily. Let's get kind of run over here, guys. I do expect to come out on like the other. Oh, more guys over here. There's all the javelins there. Where'd the general go specifically? He is. They've got a lot of javelins here. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. Because they are advancing on me now. So I need to kind of. They've got a lot of javelins, so I don't want to rush in there too uh, before I'm ready. Balance of power is decently in their favor, but I don't think that's actually the case as soon as they get anywhere near us. I think we're gonna have a duel over the ownership of all of our holdings. Oh, nice. I know that's too close to attacking over there. I can take it more. Um, this campaign. This is what it is. I'm gonna like how you should present the narrative that single handedly defeated Haspel. It's a narrative that he's trying to push. It can make sense from a certain point of view as to why he's uh, viewing it that way. Okay, you guys, are you still not advancing? Not advancing any further. I'd like for you to advance a little bit further to me. Oh, is there general in front now? Yeah, he is kind of in. I think I'm actually gonna start moving my men up. Because at the moment, um, I do have the advantage in ranged. 
They have just javelins. I've got archers. Let's move all of you guys up this way. They're kind of advancing onto us. If they're going to keep advancing, I actually want to stop. Yeah, everybody stop where you are. Because it looks like they are making their way up to us. It's just my archers, though. You guys kind of more like so. Yeah, they're, still, they're, they're making their way over. So let's hold off. Okay, I'll try and keep up with them a little bit, because we're going to want to make sure we run down the entire army once their general's dead. And the general's in front. Oh, God. Let's see. Are they all bald, or is it just me? No, uh, I'm I'm seeing them also as all bald. At least the... Uh... Yeah, the cannibals are all bald. Every last one of them. Let's see, that's a cannibal unit. Just all the cannibals. Okay, you guys going to stop? No, what the hell are you doing? Kind of going off to the side a little bit. Okay, let's adjust. Let's kind of have you guys go like so. Uh, archers, like, oh god, the game is just glitching out. Tree stop. Okay, you guys go there and there. Oh my god, why? Stop, please! My eyes, they hurt! Like, I already have the, um, nope, oh, not that one. Uh, graphic settings. Yeah, it's supposed to be vegetation details, what's supposed to do that. I might lower it down further. Okay, you guys are just chilling there. Now you are slowly advancing. Okay, make up your mind, guys. Let's see, having cannibals in your army is smart because you don't have to pay for food and they are basically free cleanup crew. Here's the one who's like the attack problem. Uh, what I'm going to down. I can try and do that. PCs. Almost seems as though he is acting like Bran Stark in the final season. It burns. Guys, hurry up and get over here. Can't, oh, finally they're in range. That's what I want. Because I'm expecting to slaughter you guys as soon as you're properly in range. I'm just walking back and okay, you guys are just you're just toying with me. Let's move my guys up a little bit. So let's move up here a little bit. You guys to right here. Just get my archers in range, and then we should start slaughtering these guys. Cav, okay, kind of get a little bit closer. Oh, are my guys just all hidden? Is that why? Oh, I think that's got to be the case. Let's keep moving forward. Actually, I'm just gonna group up all of you, so it's easier to move you guys forward. We wasted so much of the timer so far. I think that should be good enough. There we go. Now we can start opening up on them. There we go. Now I actually see the casualties. Okay. Gav, just go up here. Five percent are already dead. Awesome. Yeah, you guys are shredding them. Oh my god. Having an all cav army almost. Sorry, not all cav. All archer army works wonders against this. Where's the general? He's the only, like, wilding warrior I saw in here. I think everybody else is, like, javelins. No, I don't. Oh, no, no, in the back. But he's out of range right now, so I can't hit him. Let's see, how are they surviving the winter without hair or something on their head? They just toughen it out! Let's see, those are these raiders and cannibals. Let's keep them right away. Let's lead them up. Yeah, now they're finally committing to a fight. Make sure that my infantry, you guys, are going to have guard position on. Cav, let's have you guys kind of move around. Ignore the javelins. Oh, definitely get away from the javelins. Run away. Uh, okay, you didn't take any damage there. Good. Oh, you, took, you lost one, one guy. That's fine. Okay, let's kind of loop back around. We're going to try and recharge them now. Otherwise, everybody lost 28% of their forces. Because every single shot is, like, guaranteed to get a kill, because they have no armor. So you guys will absolutely decimate them. Let's see, the Wilding Warrior is at sea. Get back over around here, guys. Uh, they are doing a lot of- they are doing decent damage in melee, though. But they're actually losing quite a bit. Okay, Our let's, men are let's hit this battle. Wilding Warrior. If we continue like this, that we should be their general. The should enemy. be able to break him pretty easily and kill him. Once they're dead... Uh... Took out the entire bodyguard in almost a single charge? Yeah, just about. I should see he's dead any second now. Come on. By the saints, 
Our men have slain the enemy general. The enemy general is now Without out of the him, picture. His troops will lose their Let's will charge to forward fight. with my cab, try and see if we can now shatter them all, now that he's out of the picture. Yep, they're already breaking. I wonder the if the cannibals have unlimited blooded. morale. They I can almost see the cannibals having man. unlimited morale. Okay, start trying to run all these guys down. You guys don't actually feel like you're concerned at all. I think the cannibals might have unlimited morale. Let's see how much character that, that assault. Only I do, as the god of the world. That's number wise, we're at 67. Gonna keep running this down. Let's run down all the javelins first. And then we'll try and start recharging the uh, cannibals. Just like these javelins up here. 82. I do want to make sure we grab those guys back there. There's a lot of them back there still. Although, let's hit the cannibals. See if we can get a, them to break or not. No, I think the cannibals straight up have unlimited morale. That charge didn't do anything to them. Okay. Let's kind of run down these javelins. I, it's primarily now just letting my infantry fight them here for the most part now. Because they already lost a magic 85 so far. Let's just have some guys kind of start playing around you guys. Can I go around them? Let's see, just saying, Ramp, I don't mind helping you in the war since you pay me, but I don't make me charge giants. What? I can't have you charge giants? Aw, that's part of the. That's all the fun, though. Like, that's total. Okay, if there's any way that I wouldn't mind if uh, Gabe's character accidentally died, totally has to be he's punted by a giant or something. <laughs> totally would be. Okay, that's. That's not a stupid way to die. No, it's it's against a giant. It's it's a very honorable way to die. Uh, let's see, Carlo, here are the officers. Uh, let's just say not seeing where it did handily. Uh, I'm back. What's happened? Uh, we are pushing into the free folk right now. Pushing into the free folk. We are slaughtering them. Although the cannibals do not want to die, they got unlimited morale and are not breaking. Other than that, for the most part, most of the enemy army is now dead. We're just trying to finish off these last few guys. Because while their stats aren't the best, I really do want to like finish these guys off primarily through archers. All of Christendom will be 3,000 kills. My archers did a lot of damage there. My infantry aren't going to do a ton. They honestly need to kind of just wait for the archers to do all the work. Uh, no, because that's what it's called a suicide charge. <laughs> Let's see, Coward Osric is Carlos from Faster, the more efficient in combat. Uh, right, but let me one if you want a dragon, I can take them, especially if the dragon looks like uh, Daenerys. <laughs> Let's see, if you kill me like that, I uh, will think that you were just killing me with a freaking ballista units. <laughs> Why? Why would I do, why would I ever purposely try and get people's characters killed? That's blasphemy. Also, I was when I was trying to get the um the the Night's Watch units to be available for us, um technically giants are recruitable by us. Let's see, am I still alive, Ramp? Uh, I've been gone for a little bit. No, you're good. You're still alive. Yeah, you're still alive. I can't kill you guys that quick. Well, I could, but I I just don't. I'm merciful in that regard. But you know, if I remember correctly, I believe I think we have to have it in a specific city. But I think the giants are actually recruitable by us. Like once we uh, conquer these free folk regions, which is kind of hilarious that I can get giants. God damn it, game. Okay. Okay. Just another crash. I I honestly think this is going to be the most unstable game uh, campaign. On my channel, ever. And it's still hilarious that this is actually more stable than when I was testing this out originally. Because originally, I didn't use the um, Engine Overhaul Expansion Project. And the game kept crashing more often. Um, primarily during uh, campaign map stuff. But in the battle map, it was fine. But now, it's kind of the reverse. Which is kind of irritating, slightly. As you guys, I got burdened by our own cannon unit. Uh... I'm just kidding. A ramp. You jinxed it. <laughs> yeah. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah, we're up to like 
I think I think we're at seven crashes because we had um, we had four in the last stream. We've had three so far. <laughs> We've had three so far, and it's an hour in. Jesus. Or did we have five crashes last time? I thought we only had four. But we've won that battle. I'll use the auto win sheet again. Slaughter that army, and we'll continue making our way to hard home. Ramp, I don't kill you that quickly. Press X to doubt. <laughs> if anything at all, this campaign here, because we can actually recruit generals too, this might be one of the times that, like, I don't mind, it, where we just have a huge body count of characters, I feel like. I'm just kind of expecting it at this point right now, honestly. Well, I'm gonna have a lot of deaths, simply because I'm gonna be throwing the, uh... The, North remembers. Um, the Free I'm Folk General's fight. bodyguards away. So yeah, we won this battle pretty easily. So, we'll use the auto win attacker because of the crash. Slaughter them again. Honest. Okay, that's that's way too way too well in our favor, but sure. Keep making your way up towards Hanho. Uh, I'm gonna have you guys, I'm gonna have you finish them off. I think we'll ignore that. We'll just go straight towards hard home with you guys. Um, that ship I think is done next turn. Yeah, next turn we'll have that ship ready. The North remembers! Okay. We almost have the entire area lit up. Winter is coming. Okay, I'll take you up here. I, won't I think that's almost you. it. Begging your Holy Winter shit! Is coming. Almost all of the north is lit up finally. We're we'll gonna light it up next turn, pretty much. Um, you guys can get there next turn too. Okay, because all of these the guys. Oh no, you need to keep kind of moving along with us. The north yeah, keep moving along with us. Help us out. I'm hoping that the. I'm really hoping you. the giants don't fuck us over. I'm really hoping they don't. But um, let's just keep recruiting again. These guys here are so cheap. I'm gonna keep endlessly recruiting them. The generals. I'm gonna ignore the wildling warriors because if that is a general's bodyguard, I don't want to have too many of them. I understand. Let's see. Does anyone know where you can find a generalist for the War of Five Kings? Uh, I'm not sure exactly specifically. Um, I say my Irish death is the most famous one on this channel. Honestly, I I think it is. Oh fuck you, Targaryens. They stole my silver. I didn't say anything because I didn't want I to understand. say it, but I'm willing to bet there was going to be a crash after the battle. Uh, what's uh, Jory's stats? Uh, I don't think he's changed. Oh, actually, yeah, we do need to double check that. The North remembers. Yeah, your command is up to five. So Jory Horn was now up to five for his command. I'm going to update that now before I forget. So he's got up to five command now. And his income modifier went up one more. Perfect. Uh, let's see, do you, yeah, you do have five stars now. <laughs> Are the Rice Wilson Dustin troops ready to rally up with me? Um, they take three turns to recruit. That's the one thing we have to remember, that it does take a lot longer to recruit units, but yeah, we've got three guys there. Winter is coming. For the most part, all oh, these guys are good. So the next turn is when they'll finish recruiting. The North remembers. Uh, you can finally come up here. And I, I need you to... You. Oh, actually, I can build up some uh, watchtower here. I'm sorry. Let's build up a watchtower at least up in the mountains. The then I'll send you back to Deepwood Mott. I won't disappoint you. Okay, so we've got that, that. I've got this ship ready. Is coming. I need you to make your way over here to Skagos. Grab these Winter extra men. Command, you making your way over towards Hardhome. I will do as you command. Yeah, Winter which we can coming. now start sieging. I say we fight. I understand. And then after this, we'll bring back uh, this army. We'll actually start making our way down south. Is I can coming. leave uh, hard home to you guys. I'm actually going to start making my way over this way. Oh, hello! Uh, you're in my remembers. way. You the should get the hell out of my way. I say we fight. Winter okay. is coming. Yeah, because we'll start making our way next to uh, Fist of the First Men. Uh, they haven't moved a lot of guys over here just yet, thankfully. I kind of want to get too far away from here, but I do want to double check and see if there's any other land up here. Which I don't see... No, this is all the same area, so they've got stuff over to the west. What the hell is going on the map? Okay, that's weird. But how dare you? This is totally gonna be the reason why we go to war with you guys. Oh, oh this is so much money now. I love it. We're gonna make so much money by the time we're done with that. Um, and then how much would this do? I just do another 200. But it would help grow. It would actually help grow the area now. Um. So I got some extra guys around here. So I am gonna have it so that Winter you want to go coming. down south. Winter is coming. So I'll bring you with these guys. The the Watchtower. Oh, we're supposed to grab one more. Grab those. Keep making your way down towards Mount Caleb. 
doing what's best. Um, and then I think... Yeah, I think that's it for all of you guys. Our economy is not doing as well as I would like right now. But no, no, I'm gonna have it so again. I'll keep moving more of the... You guys go over there so I can bring this rice wheel unit up to help out with the these North guys. There you command, my lord. There we go. And then let's see. So, Rampant, did you see that the letters me and Janie wrote? Yes, I did. Uh, he's just a fucking Giga Chat. I think you might have to check it via the actual mod game. Let's see. Are you still bringing my carriage up north? Uh, Dr. E, yes. You are currently right here. I'm uh, just about to drop you off light. So, Martin Mormont is now making his way up north to try and help out. Although, actually, I do need more reinforcements in the form of you guys going north to help out with these wildlings. So, I'll have to start getting some more guys there. I've got at least some more reinforcements here a little bit. And probably what I'll do is, when we send back uh, Gabe's character, we'll send back just the Mandrily units with him. Everybody else around here is going to stay and help fight up north. But the Mandrily units will go back down towards um, White Harbor, I would say. No, I missed this from uh, Tree's Judgment. Uh, we'll see. It was fun being here. However, unfortunately, I have to start my own. Now, I wish you a nice stream, and maybe I'll see you later, but that depends on how long I stream for tonight. So, bye. Alrighty, Crazy Dutchman. Glad to have you here, man. Um, They're actually attacking me by a decent amount. Okay. Well, you guys are crap. And, oh, they've got a giant. Oh, shit, they've got a giant. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Let me, uh, let's see. So, the giant is in the... Okay, so who's attacking me? So it's actually the army that's selling uh, in the city is selling now. No, more okay, Moore's is attacking me, so it's the city from behind here is one of those giants. Okay. Okay! We can fight some giants! Let's see how this goes! And then if I no, you're not gonna arrive at Castle Black for a while. You are very far away from Castle Black. Okay, so everyone watching for the next stream, I'll be taxing your characters 500 dragons every time you pass through Castle Black, whether you're going beyond the wall or coming from beyond the wall. Uh, where am I at? Uh, Josh Brogan for Guardian. I'm not sure. I'll have to double check that in a second. But let me start the a battle. So, the giants are the ones coming in from behind us. Got my calf. It's got my infantry. So, I think ideally, I'm going to pull back here. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm going to go defend this hill. Uh, this is honestly probably going to be like right next to their uh, reinforcements. So let's have you guys go like right there. And then archers. Let's have you guys go right here. Because I'm expecting them to step on like right about here. And we'll have to see how bad it's going to be to kill giants with archers. The enemy have brought up more Basically all of you they guys. To make up in numbers what they lack in so courage. there's the giant. He's a missile cab unit. Oh technically I can use stakes to kill them. Ooh. I will also. This is Council. Oops, sorry, Castle Black. Sorry. Um, you can also bring us Gibbs units with me because they are my best now. True. Oh, we gotta feel about this. Pray for me, my friends. I don't think it's gonna be the worst. I'm hoping. Because the Giants have uh, no shield. So it's a similar thing to what happened with. Um, what's going on with my Mordor campaign is the Giants might die really quickly to Archer Fire. That is my hope. Because if they don't, oh, this is going to be painful. Good luck, Gabe. Let's see, as long as you guys can just like focus down the giant. Good tidings. Yeah, he's dead. Enemy general lies dead. We have Okay, giants are actually really easy to kill. Oh, that's beautiful. Okay, so now we don't have to worry. The giants just got shot to hell by archers. Perfect. That's it. I wish good fortune in the wars to come, Gabe. Aaron, we're good. Gabe, good. <laughs> we were thought of the giant in, in a uh, rather uh, anticlimactic matter. That's good. That's good. I, I do want to make sure we can try and get some of the giants in our army, because I would love to have those like going down south, using them to help expand and conquer. So definitely focus on the cannibals. It's, they only have cannibals here. That's all they have. And the cannibals do have unlimited morale, so we'll have to just try and op hopefully slaughter them all with infantry my skirmishers. Only half dead. the enemy force remains. Okay, so I want to finish you guys off soon so I can adjust. Because they're bringing men over. Oh my god, that giant died quicker than uh, my run over cat. Oh, Jesus. I, I guess that's an accurate statement. I guess. Okay, 
Cannibals are almost all dead. Oh, excuse me. Uh, let's give him Hunter Bowman with a dozen arrows each. Good fortune is not needed. Okay, they're just about to come around the corner. Cannibals are almost all dead. Once they are, we can adjust. I haven't lost a single man just yet, thankfully, because they're just sitting there being shot at. Is that all of them? Yep, that's all of them. Okay, so let's now adjust my infantry. Let's have you guys kind of go this way. And then I'll have my archers adjust as well. Now we need to make sure we take out the general here. Okay, kind of run up to the side there, guys. Advancing on up. The cannibals are the ones we really want to focus on primarily. General's in the back, it looks like. Oh, he is a silvery man for some reason. Okay. Well, he's going to be very easy to spot and target. Let's see. Oh, Janie is still here. Uh, yeah. Uh, Brother Giants are like, I'm going to kill you, get hit with a twin, and they die. <laughs> um, let's see. And one last thing. Die that quick. Um, also, can you build a better smithy in White Harbor to improve my army's weapons and armor? I can try and do that. We're still trying to finish all the trade stuff first, but I can try and do that after that. Okay, so you guys should be opening up with my archers. Release, my good sons! Release my stock boys! Because 42% of the force are already dead. I don't like that. That's a lot. My cavalry, let's kind of group you guys out the ground backs here. Let's try and make sure we kill the general in the back. Archers to do their thing. Got quite a few... Quite a few javelins in this army. I'll kind of run off to the side a little bit more. Uh, yeah, don't get shot at by the javelins, please. Okay, kind of loop around the side here. Get straight to fight in melee. It's always the cannibals. Fuck. Wild and Spearman don't care about it, you guys. Let's hit the Wilding Warriors. We should be able to kill the captain in the charge. Come on, let's see if he's going to survive. He survived the Our initial charge. The enemy general okay, has no he's dead. Honor. He flees the field of okay, battle. Now let's go hit the man. javelins. Uh, because then we're gonna have to actually properly surround the Yeah, surround the cannibals to finish them off. I can't, I can't, uh let's see later. Uh Okay, Jenny, uh Jenny will leave the council. Awesome! Sounds good. Yeah, I trust either you or Jenny to leave the council, Patrick. Either one works. Only half the enemy force That's remains. So 75% of the forces are dead. We will now have to adjust my archers. Let's take, like, you two. Let's try and have it so... Oh, those spearmen. Oh, yeah, okay, let's try and move some of my archers over here. I'm going to have you guys try and focus on the cannibals. These javelins are still alive. I'll run them down in a second. We just need to kind of finish running these guys down. So a couple of you over here. We're already at the magic 85. Now we just need to finish Our off men the cannibals. Our winning the battle. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy! I think Archer like, is a spot that you guys don't finish. This is my fun, he's actually just in this. Unlike, uh, Joffrey Buster has been in the past, and is it stupid? I, I, I will say that Osric at the moment so far has definitely done more than Joffrey ever did. Oh, also his lack of sadism. Yeah, no, that was given to your brother this time. Okay, you guys almost out of ammo? No, you're still focusing. Yeah, focus on the cannibals. Those are the only thing we have to really worry about right now. Everybody else has given up. So it's just like, what, 15 of you, 20 of you. I can probably pull back here and get a good charge on them to properly try and kill them all. Yeah, the Sadim is mine. Yeah. The the brother stock is the one that went insane. This Well, not insane. Just uh, has all the sadism for themselves this time. Is it everybody? Oh no, there's still one more cannibal. That Look should be the last one, and there we go. Fly, Saint Andrew. Not bad. Only 167 kills on my Let side. Let all who remember this day remember God. it as the day I of our I feel most so overpowered victory. fighting beyond the wall against wildlings. Like, it's kind of crazy. Just having a bunch of archers just means I slaughter them. Uh, by the way, what did y'all think of my solar protection? I don't know that. I think it was pretty good. I know I do not have much to say actually on specific feedback. Oh, that's a stretch. Oh, that was a really good stretch. Now, game, please do not crash. Knock on some wood for that, just in case. 
because we've been having a lot of luck so far. Unluck. Uh, unluck. With uh, the fact that uh, it keeps crashing after every fucking battle. Just please load through. I don't. I feel bad continuously using the auto win sheet. Like, hey, we won this battle, and then we have to be like just use the auto win sheet to get back to it. <laughs> I thought it was cool. It really fucked up. <laughs> that is a good way to describe it for sure. Looks like the game's going to make it through. Ooh. Fucked up Carlin was so merciful. That's um one way to describe it, I guess. I'll do as you command, my lord. There we go, we were able to make it through. Kill awesome. It. So now hard home is mine. And I think for hard home we will exterminate and assimilate the populace, as I would say. Hello, Night's Watch. I hate that I can't get rid of your agents. I have to wait for them to die of old age before they stop talking to me continuously. I give two thumbs up, Janny. Uh, Carl is a man of few words, and instead is more about action. So merciful. Ooh, Harder makes this an okay amount of money. Okay, and then you guys also have these units as well. Perfect. Okay, so... I think what we'll Winter do is, is uh, make sure is you coming. send... Well, actually, we don't have any of them Winter over here. Is coming. We do have some from over here, though. So let's keep recruiting you guys. The North oh, actually, no, the, the cannibals are the ones Winter that free up keep. So grab the cannibals and then these guys. The I'll just send these guys over to help uh, watch over hard home, I would say, for us. The North remembers. And then now, I'm going to have you guys keep making your way forward. We need to get to the Fist of the First Men. Oh, you're still alive. The North remembers. Uh... You do not have that odds. You think you have that odds, but you don't have that odds. Give me a second. I'm gonna. I want to quickly Winter fight this because I don't I think they have that good odds. Our house will never fall. Let's see. When it crashes after you've won a battle, I would say it's acceptable to do the auto win. He didn't play him, did he? Uh, yeah, a bit short though. The more in my own presence, the slower your sentence be a few pages long. Oh, you pick up. Yeah, I think that's up to everyone's own discretion on how long they want to have their solo RPs be. But yeah, let's grab my archers here, because I think, honestly, that's all I need. Is just these four. Just these four slaughtering them should be pretty easy. So I get you guys a little closer. I'll have uh, you guys move up a little bit. Okay, let's get you guys up here. Because they've only got the one cannibal and the one wildling warrior unit. Yeah, if you guys can get a volley off, start unloading on them. And yeah, now they're starting to open up on us. They're starting to run towards us. Okay, keep running at them, or keep shooting them. With the four units here, it should not take us long to finish off this cannibal. And then you can actually break. I love how, like, the wildlings just don't understand what the fuck a bow is. They're like, what is this strange contraption that allows you to throw things from afar without having to use your arm like a chucking device? I just kind of love that, honestly, that the wildlings just have, like, no archers whatsoever. It's just a foreign concept. Only half the enemy force remains. Right, you guys are supposed to be running. You guys can back here. The battle is very much in our favor. Uh, if we remain two... true and steadfast, victory will be ours. A little bit more, and then unload into the cannibals. The enemy general the has no running. He flees the field Archie of battle and off. abandons his men. The enemy army flees the field. After them, cut the caverns down. Okay, there we go. Yep, come on. Yeah, just being stupid. There we go. Can I please have YouTube chat back in? Or computer? There we go. Uh, what are we at now? We are at 99. So and battle all there. Of Christendom will be in awe of the victory we have won. And Gabe, you did rank up. Nice. Um, you're not a cell sword though, aren't you? So I don't think that matters too much specifically. Or are you? No, you are a cell sword. Okay, I'll have to double check that. Uh, fair enough, Patrick. I was sure because I made sense for me that the mine is just a tough story when I is no longer necessary to keep her running. I was trying not to fall into the cartoonish villain trap that Gil, uh, Gil has fallen into before. That is a good thing to try and avoid <laughs> when you can. <laughs> hey, <laughs> it's accurate though, Gilbert. Your characters are very cartoonishly evil at times. 
they're not very complex characters in uh, in their goals and uh, motivations. No, yeah, very fair. <laughs> I actually kind of feel bad that oh, god damn it game <sighs> so it feels I, I didn't knock on wood this time and it crashed once more I feel like it's like every other battle we're getting the crash which I kind of hate I'm hoping it's just because we're fighting up north if it's I'm hoping it's not going to be literally every other battle so we have a 50 50 chance of a crash uh ramp wait till you see what my character gets up to Ooh, I'm excited to see what you are going to do, my good son. Let's see, so describing Carnage needs to be balanced out, otherwise I'm just uh, repeating Death, Blood, Carnage again and again. Uh, at least he wasn't like Flower in the Storm Cup campaign. <laughs> Stop jinxing Hydro. <laughs> I don't know if it's jinxing it. It's more so, he's, he's just, he has future sight. Let's see, my characters are extremely low, rounded, and complex. Ram, how many turns have passed since I started moving Castle Black? Uh, I've... I, I don't know. Uh, I don't know specifically. I can just check where your character is again exactly. Um, see where he's chilling at. Because I know it's going to take him like seven to eight turns or something like that. It's going to take a while because he's literally going from across the entirety of the north. I honestly almost expect at this rate that our war for the north is going to be done by the time he gets up there because these wilding armies the biggest threat they pose is they crash the game that's literally it because it's not hard for me remembers. to win these I fights fight. with a couple archers with a couple archers we slaughter these guys and we just keep pushing forward Watchtower's the there, remembers. north, Winter or over that way, and yeah, once we're done with uh, around here, so I will be the grabbing them, remembers. actually by about the time that we get up to here almost, Lord. we'll be ready to move out, because I just want to make sure that these cannibals are going to be remembers. watching over hard home, so they'll be three turns world. away, then we can move I you guys out, and you'll be making your way back down towards White Harbor, who at the moment, oh man, it almost makes 8,000, almost, uh, Winterville, is there anything I can do for your income? Uh, that does give public border bonus as well. Oh yeah, that gives me another about 200. I can grab that, I will say. Because, uh, let me run this up. So, there's Field Fighter. Your character specifically, again, is Field Fighter. Where did you go? Yeah, he's your Georgian Reed. Uh, he is... Winter is coming! One, two, three, four, five, six. So he's six turns away from Castle. Do as you command, my lord. So he's a couple turns Winter away still. Uh, you can go and word. then I will grab this guy and bring him up to help out the in the front. Do as you command, my lord. And then I was recruiting some more stuff around here. Can I get some... I honestly feel like I'm just going to keep eating more archers. Although I do need to make sure I give, uh, get a couple infantry units every once in a while. Although I do need a cav unit for sure. I'll have to make sure I grab that next turn. We desperately do need some more archers. Uh, uh, just cab in here. Because cab and archers are extremely important for fighting against the wildlings at this point in time. Great expanse, better commander. We don't care about you. Um, but yeah, let's see. So Gabe did go up. You are now up to three stars. So I will make sure I will update that. You now have up to three stars on your command. So three stars there. And you get a little bit more money. There you go. <laughs> Come get it, you bastard. Get it. Uh, I think it shouldn't the wrestle and the dustins be done by now. Um they should be done for sure right now. So we've got these two Winter guys. The We're making remembers. them move over this way. I'm a man of my word. And then I won't these three you. actually I'm gonna do it. Winter is coming! Winter is coming! The North remembers! I will you there Winter and then Glover. We've got these guys, so they'll be Winter there with you in about you two, command, three turns. Uh, well, five or six turns here, actually, because these guys are going to take a while to get over here. I and I am not you. making that much money. Uh, I'm a little worried there. Oh, we have another star Stark. Ryman Stark now. So we have another son! I personally feel like I might have to claim this one, but at the moment, also, I don't know if I'm ever going to die. <laughs> Honestly, because, like... 
Rob Mormont is 76 and is still kicking this game. Like, what is the upper remembers. limit for age in this oh, moment? I don't know. Winter is coming. Like, I just don't know what it is. The North remembers. Okay, two more turns for oh, you guys to get to hard home. Uh, I am not making that much money now. Winter is coming. I am not making that much money. The North remembers. I need to take more. Winter is coming. Because you guys are here. You're trying to make your way up to the first of the first men. Winter is coming. You can push through this guy pretty easily. You'll have it. Get we got an army. We got some more giants in there. As long as we make sure we focus on them with my archers, we should be fine. This is the first men is just before us. The North remembers. You guys keep trying to catch up with us. And I think once we get you out of here and we can send most of these guys to help out, that'd be a little bit better. I will do as you command, my lord. These men, I will have these guys go along with us. But basically, it'll be you. The North remembers. And these guys will be leaving. Everybody else will be staying. Winter is coming. Right, because that's all of the other cell swords. There's some manually pikemen still in here. So those as well. You will then be making your way down to White Harbor. So I'll bring you back over this way. It's gonna take you a very long time to get down there. I'm gonna hope we don't have any rebel fleets that decide to attack you, but I think we're okay. I think. Um also would you rename the Dreadfort to Newcastle? Uh, I'm going to wait until you guys figure out your duel, Gilbert, before I do that. Let's see, yes, I'm leading uh, the Conquest of the Veil. Let's see. Let's see, it is okay for me and Jenny to roll our own dice for the duel, or do we need you to be there? Um, I will trust your integrity that if you roll two dice yourselves, that uh, do just a best two out of three, I would say. Whoever wins gets the land. How many turns per year? It's supposed to be four, technically, I believe. Let's see, let's see. When Rob Mormon outlives Elrond. <laughs> let's see, isn't the age limit in Divine Conquer like 126? Oh, it's really high in Divine Conquer for sure. And I feel like this mod's kind of similar, honestly, almost. Because, Winter is coming. again, right now, Rob Mormon is 76. He is having no uh, indicator that he is feeling old. So I honestly feel like he almost might physically be just immortal. I would love if he was, because that'd make things really easy for us um, on uh, worrying about character deaths and crap like that. Because the at the North moment, I, that's the main thing that I always worry about with these RP campaigns, is that people's characters just die of old age of before world. they get to do anything cool. I won't disappoint you. That's actually Begging your pardon, my lord, but it's not hard. You. Also, I need to double check coming. and make sure. I don't have any excess random troops just saying about doing nothing. Because we're barely making money at this point in time right now. Because the wildlings are really cheap, so we don't care about them. Uh, I do have some stuff in the last North turn, remembers. which basically next turn I can just grab these guys. The he bringing you up north I'll to help out with command, these guys. The You're already going north as well. Command, Is there anybody else besides you? I've got a well. That's a Winter manually pike coming. unit, but I think they'll they'll stay around here. Um, actually, I'll have you guys go over to White Harbor. Because that's where we're going to be sending Gabe's character anyways. Those guys will be pushing forward soon once the cell swords get there to what? Not cell swords. Once the, um... The North I'm going to send these flint units over as well. I'm a man of my word. Um, once we get our forces me. up into the... I'll do what's best. I think. Oh, no, there's some more here. Winter is coming. I'll send you over this way as well. I will do as you command. So I want to make sure we're using every able-bodied man. That guy's not free on Keeper Bugs. Everybody else is, but just not that one. Okay, that's all we've got then for that. Winter and then is next coming. turn, you guys will be able to hit them over there. It's just Superior Northman Jeans ramp. We're just built different. <laughs> Let me at them. Honestly, I just want to make the South burn. Um, maybe should I do a similar thing in this campaign like I did in our uh, Divine Conquer Reunited Kingdom campaign? It's been so long since that campaign, I can't remember exactly what you did in that campaign. I understand. Atsy Ram sent me to where the next war will start uh, and train my army there instead, please. Okay, because field fighter, yeah, I was sending you up towards Castle Black. The North remembers. But once we're done with the North, basically we're gonna be expanding south. So I'll send you down this way. I will do as you um, command, my lord. And you are the you are of the Krago men. If I'm gonna I do anything, so we probably grab you troops from around here. Which literally, there's just Krago men. That's it. Oh, I'm losing money now. Ah, oh, shit. 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 Um. Oh, it's because of you guys. No, you're free upkeep. The North okay, remembers. I'm losing money. Awesome. Okay. Uh, well, these Winter guys will be free upkeep coming. soon. 
In two turns, they'll be free upkeep, then I can grab all these guys, bring them over this way. We have a ton of Umber men. I love how it's literally just all Umber is pushing north. We're using the Umbers to reclaim the, uh, and attack the free folk. Uh, let's have it so you kind of like right there. And then uh, you get the hell out of my way. And then let's hit this captain here. Our house will never fall. They say we have such bad odds, but I don't see it. Oh, they have a lot of giants. Oh, they've got a lot of giants. Oh, King Beyond the Wall? What's your bodyguard? You're just, you're just wildly more of yours. I think we're fine. I'm actually going to command you guys myself. Um, and I'm going to go to where you guys are at. Let's make sure we get a quick save for this. This is going to be an interesting battle here. We might kill the King Beyond the Wall. They have a lot of giants, but those oh, we saw how easy it was to kill the giants, so I don't think we're going to worry too much about that. Oh, so that's something as well. Let's see, we need to improve our free upkeep buildings. All sworn infantry like Burger Bird. As a current, I just want to burn the south uh, like Sherman did. Well, it wouldn't be a rampant campaign. Yeah, it wouldn't be a rampant campaign if we didn't go bankrupt. Let me at him! He's the same face as my guy. Um, just get gray water watch troops because that is my plan. Alrighty, I can try to do that. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna kinda go over here. I wanna make sure we're at the area where my allies are reinforcing us from. And I'm gonna make sure that we're gonna basically just throw those infantry units away as much as we possibly can. And then, let's see, bring a few guys here, there and there. And then we have to make sure that we focus on their giants first and foremost. We've only got one guy at a time, but hey, it's right next to them. I'm hoping that because they have more men than us, they will advance over to us. Giants are top priority. We have to focus down giants, top priority with my archers. After that, it's then trying to focus on taking out captains. Although, this army has got a lot of javelins. I don't see many cannibals. As long as they don't have any cannibals, this army is actually really easy to deal with. Oh, there's no cannibals in this army. There's just a lot of giants. I think they don't have any cannibals in these forces. They've got four giants, though. Mm-hmm. Yep, four giants. Uh, what about the other armies? Fuck, I win. Who won that? Oh, uh, Gilbert won. Oh, that's gonna make things interesting. So, Gilbert will get all of Janny's land, if I am understanding this correctly. Uh, once you guys do, like, an RP... Uh, thing in the channel, then I can I can solidify it and do that after the stream, I'd say. Duel, me and Jenny are gonna roleplay it in a bit. Alrighty, sounds good. That'd be great to see. I guess there's a couple uh, cannibals over there. And then over here, there are also a couple cannibals. But most of the troops are not cannibals. Okay. Also, uh, you, I literally don't care about. I will be throwing you guys away as quickly as possible. the dice say I won. Awesome. This is going to be interesting. That is the older brother that won the duel. But yeah, once you guys roleplay that out, I'll uh, adjust that on the uh, Excel sheet. First was a draw, second was a loss, uh, but for me, but the next two I won. Nice. Oh my god, Carlin is going to turn straight up traitor after this. I actually might not be too surprised if that happened. Possibly. Make sure he has a guard mode on, and we just need to make sure we switch right off. Okay, so we're waiting on the enemy to make their way over here, because they are advancing onto us. So we don't have to wait, we don't, we're just gonna sit here. Seeing as how they have so many fucking armies, I'm not going, there's so many army troops, uh, that I'm just gonna sit here. Because, for the most part, the troops' quality on the enemy side is pretty bad. That as long as I can make, break them, we'll be able to easily run them all down. I'm gonna go south. You want to join me, Jamie? Yes, everybody just wants to go down south. I honestly feel like you guys are gonna like make me want to try, try and conquer the entire entirety of Westeros. Although, honestly, this one is actually not that difficult to rapidly expand. Public order-wise, everybody fucking loves me. Uh, for the most part. And so it's pretty easy for us to just continue expanding down south. Especially since we've got a really defensible position up north. And once we've de dealt with the um, the free folk and the undead. There's literally only w one way to expand. And that is south. Let's see, which channel are you guys going to do? 
I think that we put in the uh, RP uh, channel, uh, RP Discord. I'm not sure if I get to exterminate all of the cities to capture. I feel like Gabe might be okay with that. Uh, yeah, Ram, I thought it was decided that we're going to take all of Westeros. It was thought about, it wasn't specifically put in stone just yet. In that case, no, the most we do is sack and extermination. The only time we're sacking and sort of exterminating is when we're going up north, at least. Okay, you guys are taking a really long time to get over here. Are you guys not going to advance on me? I thought you guys might because you have superior numbers. No, looks like they are. Actually, I can just do this. Forward! Forward, my father general! Go forth! Try and uh, parlay with your people and uh, die trying. Let's see, uh, I think after beating the Wildlings and the White Walkers, I should be sent to fight the Targaryens and the Dragons. Maybe even take some uh, pretty tar princesses as to wife. Yeah, I, I honestly don't oppose that idea, because for the most part, we can kind of have uh, multiple fronts going down south. We can have some fronts that are literally the only idea is, oh, we're going to be going straight down south. Oh, you're going to try and fight one of the Giants. Oh, you poor, poor bastards. At least this is a good test. See how much damage the giants can do. Uh, okay, he lost a third of his unit in one hit. Awesome. He's trying. He is trying. He. Oh. Okay, he got punted. He's not dead, but he did get punted in the knee. But oh, he's breaking. Okay, so they are advancing onto us now. I just need to make sure that hopefully my uh, arch is able to take the rest of them out, though. But hey, that one giant, the uh, general, was a good test at least. Let's see, how about this? Uh, we do whatever, but the RPY is we need to kill all the rich of the cities we come here. has arrived! Hey man, how's it going? Nice, by the way, Ram, send me to White Harbor. Okay, I can try and send you, uh, remind me after the battle. Uh, you're still chasing those guys. I need you to actually go towards my archers, please. Okay, there we go, they're making their way over. Nope, they're not. Ooh, that was a nice charge. My next goal should be to claim Harrenhal. Ooh, Harrenhal, that would be difficult. Harrenhal is pretty far from us right now. Okay, as long as the giants die before they charge us, please. Come on, they're being shot at. Uh, please die before you get to my men. Uh, you did not die before you got to my men! Please keep shooting them. Do not stop. Do not stop shooting them. Come on. This is not looking good if you guys can't kill one of the generals because the giants, there's so many of them. By the almighty lord or a military genius oh, can bring us victory from this mess. Because I need you guys to kill the giants before they get to us in melee. He hasn't been attacking a ton. There we go. There we go. There's one giant dead. Uh, I see another one coming up, isn't it? Yes. If you guys can shoot them. I don't know. We've got like, what, one giant down? We have multiple to go. Oh, God. Oh, as you ran, if he survives, can I have him? Uh, the this guy, I guess. If you really want to be the wildling, I, I'm purposely trying to get them killed, honestly, because they they're units I don't really want specifically right now. Oh man, there's so many giants. Oh, there's so many giants. I think it's not difficult to expand, and it's not difficult to beat either. Some cities make ridiculous amounts of money. Uh, the King's Landing, or Bravo's, or Bendos, or the Lake Beach cities, bottom right. Oh yeah, some of the really big cities can make a ton of money. I will take him and we can invade the Vale. Alrighty. Oh, they are targeting him. Oh god, it's just all the giants chasing this one poor bastard. Yeah. <laughs> all the giants are chasing this one poor bastard. Wait, trade in Greece, what? Oh! <laughs> 
faltering courage. I didn't realize you could get traits during the battles. Interesting. Very interesting. Where's that? Oh, here it is. All my archers open up on this poor bastard. Kill this thing, please. All the giants have to kill. You have to kill the giants before they get into melee with us. Last time we took a little bit too much damage on those units, and he's not dying. It's the same unit that he's going towards. I'm sorry, guys. Keep shooting him, archers. Do not stop. Okay, I need to bring you up in front. They are currently going for you. Come on, keep shooting him. Keep shooting him. Are they bringing another giant up? Yeah, they are. Um. Okay, he's dead now. That one's dead now. Uh, now it's gonna be this one is the one that we're trying to shoot next. Okay, focus this one down now. He's just kind of sitting there at least. But if anything, I need to just bring this unit up in front of my units because they keep showing after you. It's me, Redwin. Oh, nice. Hey, man. I'm in charge of the invasion of the Vale. Graham, can I be in charge of the invasion of the Rivlands? Ah, oh, sure, why not? Uh, archers, okay, if you guys can't shoot them yet, don't. Don't push forward. Adjust. Need to readjust. So I've lost 5% of my guys, and they have not lost a single percentage of theirs just yet. Oh, that's painful. Oh, that is painful. We're taking out two giants, though, so far. They're just chilling there. God, there's so fucking many of you. I might have to actually be a bit more cautious in this one. Uh, can I be a Manderly? I believe all of the Manderlies have been taken at this point. Does anybody know how many turns have passed since the beginning of the stream? Uh, we started on turn 30, and so I think we've done about 10 turns, I think. Okay, you guys are not advancing on us. I wish I had horse archers. I don't want to, but I feel like I need to advance on you guys a little bit. Or maybe just send my uh, fodder unit over again to try and get you guys to run it over this way. Otherwise, we have to start solely advancing, which I kind of don't want to do, but I think we're going to have to. Because, like, we can try and make it so we'll make our way to about here. Let's try and go to about here. Archers, let's try and move up a little bit too. Cav as well. Right there, there, and there. The other Mandalay is reserved for me since it's my son. No, that Mandalay has been taken, game. The other people can be the Mandalays as well, Gabe. Uh, just because someone is the eldest, I... Technically, the only one that can reserve a character is me, uh, as to make sure I still have somebody. But for the most part, I, I do want to have it so that there are other people that can still be in that family as well. I see, I usually make it uh, priority for myself to rush Bravos and Pentos to get the Iron Bank, and the Confederation has pathetic two cities, and pathetic usually. Oh yeah, I want to send an army down to, for sure, to take over uh, Bravos. But, I know for me right now, in this mod, I kind of just thematically like us taking out the Wildlings, because they are, they're just a nuisance for us. We're definitely going to be going to conquer Bravos at some point as well. Uh, Ramp, can I reserve John Glover since he is my son? Um, Ramp, what is my character doing right now? I am honestly, I'm not sure, uh, Redwind, uh, at the moment. Uh, I don't know off the top of my head, uh, right now. Oh, actually, no. John Umber, he just finished building a watchtower, actually. Oh, wait, I thought Ethan was reserved for my character if he was dying since he is my son. I, I don't think we need to reserve characters, though, is the thing, Gabe. The, the, with this mod, characters are not dying of old age. I think everybody's immortal, so I don't think we actually have to reserve characters for people. I don't think it's necessary. 
Um, I think it's very possible that you will just have another Manderly that will come of age that you can be if you die. Let's see, a Ram. Am I considered the leader of the Reed Clan? I think you're the only Reed, um, so yes. As if I survive this campaign, I'm going to stay in, uh, say an RP that is going to take a giant skull for a bathtub. That's the million kill, gotta go for some time. Uh, I have the back seat. Alrighty. Yeah, because no one's died of old age yet so far. Let's get some guys up a little bit more. Because the thing is, this battle's actually not that bad if we kill all the giants and we take out the general. If we take out the general, I think for the most part, most of them will break. These are all crap units. They just have so many giants. Look at this. They've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Holy shit, they have twelve giants. What the hell did I walk into? They have twelve giants. They have twelve fucking giants. Oh god. Actually, you know what I'm gonna do? I wanna go over here. I wanna go over here. I actually want to be able to fucking see what I'm doing. So let's have you guys go over here and right here. And then my cab, I'm actually going to use you to try and harass a little bit. So let's speed this up. Let's get everybody to kind of run off to the side here. I just want to be able to properly see what I'm doing. And also, if we kind of keep advancing on that one angle, um, they have the high ground currently. So many fucking units. I wish I had a nuke right now or something, because there's so many of them. Let's see, was there another read on the list to use saw in the stream? Um, I don't think there was, though. With read, I thought we only had the one read. If we had any other reads, it's because they're these wildlings, and I don't want the wildlings, and the wildlings are going to get all killed. Or try to. Okay, let's have you guys keep moving over here. Um, they are not advancing on us just yet, but what I'm tempted to do is the giants are kind of going off on their own. I might try and get close enough to start shooting them with archers. Because once all the giants are dead, then we can properly commit to a fight, I think. Are those my Umba troops in the army whose army is these Umba traitors shall die by Lord Umba? They're not... What? How dare you? These are... Umba has been one of the best houses in our defense and wars against the wildlings in the north. Also, it's just the fact that it's like literally the mountain men and the umber men are the only ones that are close enough to easily be retrained and recruited up here. That's basically it. Okay, let's kind of move up a little bit more. Right about there. And right about there. Cab kind of run off to the side a little bit. Because I just need to get in range. I just need to barely get in range. Okay, so they're kind of just right in front of us. I'm hoping they'll kind of just sit back and let me shoot them. That's my hope. Because they have so many units here. Oh, they have 17 giants. 17 goddamn giants. Like, one giant's not that bad, but 17 of them is going to be interesting. Everybody's still getting into position. Come on, guys. We need to get a little... Oh, are they advancing forward yet? I do want to cannon that my character, which died of old age, my heir is my next character. Okay, Ram? Uh, but... Gabe, because, because there's so many people wanting to be characters, I can't just reserve every second the first son for the person that played the first pay character. I, I can't do that. I have to make sure that other people... I'm trying to make sure everybody has a character. And... That means that somebody has to also be the other Manderly. If another Manderly comes of age, you can be them as well. Ah, uh, Lord Hornwood has zero Hornwood troops. That is... It's, it is interesting that, yeah, he has no Hornwood troops whatsoever. Now, if I get close enough, are you guys going to start walking forward? I'm worried about this. Because my infantry can get slaughtered by their giants. My archers still aren't in range just yet. Oh, no, some of them are. Never mind. Some of my units can shoot them. So I am not going to fucking move. That's where I got to go. I'll probably be back before the stream ends. Alrighty, man. 
Because we'll probably be going for about another 50-ish minutes. Okay, I can actually kind of fucking see there. Yeah, start unloading them. Don't get too close. Just sit and wait. Get free damage as we can. Although I do need to make sure you guys save some of your ammo so you can hit the giants. Can you guys hit the giants? No, you cannot hit the giants. More of them are getting closer. I'm saying that towards my lands, wealth, and titles, I am okay with uh, being a man of the ice one to my lands and wealth. And actually the lands, that is all. Uh, yes. Oh, shit. Okay, focus on one giant at a time. Or actually, half of you focus on one, half of you focus on the other. Oh, one's already dead. Okay, one's already dead. All of my guys focus on this giant here, please. Oh, shit, they're just coming in with more, because there's... We've killed three giants now. Hit this guy, because he's easy to hit. Okay, that one giant's dead now, too. Okay, so we've taken out four giants. There's a fifth giant. This is what worries me here, is all these giants on the side. Specifically target the goddamn giants. Actually, over on the side there. Tidings. The enemy general lies dead. Because if anything's going to do us in, it's going to be hell. these fucking giants. Keep targeting one. 11 to 11. Oh, get out of there. We killed a captain. Yeah, get my calf out of there. My calf is not going to be able to fight giants. Ah, this is not looking good. Run away, run away, run away. Fuck. They are just chasing you. Keep running away there. Uh, my men are breaking. Oh, shit. Um, I think we need a tactical withdraw. Because there's too many giants. There are too many giants here. We are dying. I can't win this now at this point with how many men are, my, are breaking. So many fucking wildlings. Shit, I, I had to withdraw. Damn it! Pray something changes in the yeah, run away, guys. But defeat seems almost run away, guys. Shit! Bunch, uh, overpowered. If it wasn't for- we took out several giants, but there's just so many of the giants. Uh, you run the fuck off the map. Lord have mercy. We have lost half our men. Just run off the map, guys. There was too many giants. We killed 14% of their forces, but there was just too many giants. I hope the giants take a long time to recruit. Because if the giants take a long time to recruit, then we can very easily try and slowly whittle them down. I believe the Giga Chat Jory is going to lose his first battle. Uh, rest in peace, Lord Hornwood. Lord, uh, he is He's not dead. Uh, no, you shouldn't die. You should be able to run away. You should be able to run away, ideally. It's just most of your army's dying. Which is very concerning. Yeah, I think if I withdraw now, or just end the battle, I think you'll be... Well, you run off the map, guys. Come on. Just everybody run off the map. Damn it, those fucking giants. Archers are still trying, even though I told you guys to run away. Like, you guys are trying to fight. We were able to kill 14%, which isn't the worst, but... Man. This is not what I wanted. Run off the map, guys. Genius can bring us victory from this mess. But no, I believe you should be alive, Gabe, after this. No, sorry, Gabe. Uh, Patrick Robinson.
I need to focus on these armies one at a time. And I'm sad you didn't have night battle. Let's see, Ram, can we make uh, plans to invade Bravos, take control of the Iron Bank? Um, I'm very okay with us trying to do so. Um, especially after this battle here, where, uh, I lost so many men. I also just need more money in general. And I know Bravos can make a ridiculous amount of money. Gabe, do you want to invade Bravos or do you want to invade the Vale? Because I can have you invade the invade Bravos. I'm just going to try and with exit the battle. This defeat is a bitter drop to swallow. Because Jory Hornwood should get away. We, we only killed 1,100 guys. Cup. God damn. But he should withdraw. He should survive. And he should get away. Ram, can I march north uh, and help with the conquest, I mean, liberation of the wildlings and uh, take the cities of them? Yeah, I can try and send you up that way. Actually, I should hold the wall and invade Bravos, take the Iron Bank for the King of the North. Sure, Bravos first. Alrighty, we shall send Gabe over to Bravos. Because I think Bravos can make about as much money as uh, White Harbor. If I remember correctly. But yeah, we're gonna have to be careful pushing. I was I was giving uh, the uh, wildlings too much shit. The when you combo the amount of men they have and the giants, that's when things start getting shit. I would be honored to conquer Bravos first. Awesome. So we'll send your army down that way immediately. Who will join me? Yes, who wants to join him? I'll probably still have you stop off at uh, White Harbor initially. Just to have that... Oh, God damn it, game. Well, the game is doing us a solid and sh giving us a uh, crash there. Okay, so... Unless we can do a night battle, I think we have to actually be very careful about pushing further into Wilding Territory. Because now we at least know just how dangerous the combo of all those giants and all of the wildlings can be. Because if it's just the wildlings, that's fine. If they have wildlings and maybe just one or two giants, that's fine. If it's a bunch of wildlings where it's like, it's that was uh, almost 8,000 wildlings. And about 20 giants total? Uh, when are you next playing Mordor? Mordor is always released on Mondays and on Thursdays. I already have my Mordor video recorded, and that is ready to release for tomorrow. I think Dustin will happily take Bravos. Well, my army is alive. <laughs> I think I'll claim the Iron Bank as Umber territory. I'm gonna uh, go on this trip to Essos. So we have currently, it's going to be, we've got um, Redwind, Redwind, John Umber. So we got John Umber. We'll have Gabe's character, so we have Dominic, uh, Dominic Mendeley. Those two so far are going to be making their way over to Essos. I believe you have more command than John Umber, I believe, so you will be the one leading the army. But yeah, we're going to withdraw from that. Because you don't have night battles. The North remembers! I say we fight! I'm surprised you don't, honestly. But I will have it, so we'll be pulling back for now. We have to hold off on that. The North remembers. Uh, do you keep trying to make more men the this way? North remembers. Because I think if they try and retaliate against us, we should be okay. Winter is coming. Uh, okay, because if we can get all these reinforcements the over as well, that'll be a lot the better. North remembers. But yeah, we'll still bring you guys over towards uh, White Harbor initially. Make way over there, and then John Umber. The North remembers. Oh no, you guys actually have about the same command, actually. Okay, but I'll also send you over towards uh, White Harbor. Oh, you can try and go over there. To kill you. And I hate that I don't have enough money Winter to is coming. The North remembers. Okay. Winter is coming. Flint. You can I'll do as you command, way. The North remembers. And you're slowly building up this little Winter is coming. The North right remembers. There, right there. Winter is the North Does anybody remembers. else want to help down south? In case Winter they want to join coming. up with this army. Because we've got coming. about almost half a stack of troops around here. And we just have a the bunch North of random generals just remembers. all over the place around this area. Okay. I think that's about it for this turn then. Because if we're gonna... We're not, we'll have to you think fool. carefully about how we fight those wildlings. Let's see, I'll claim the Iron Bank as Umber Territory. And then see... Uh, Theodustin, send me ramp over to the bank. Okay, mm -hmm. I... Miss that before I did the end turn. I'll make sure I move you over at the start of the turn. 
Oh, uh, thank you. Mordor is one of the best you're going, in my opinion, but please get started. Start getting better units. Oh, I'm trying to. I am trying to, Abdul. Uh, Gateway can join you as well in this invasion. Oh, okay, so Joshua Bowen Fogarty, you are, yeah, Theo oh. Dustin, which currently... Where is Theo Dustin? Uh, they... They go. There they are. So you are currently... Oh, yeah, you're up north. Winter is coming! The so, north I'll remembers. have it so everybody that's joining in for the invasion of Bravos are going to go to White Harbor. Command, my lord. You guys are actually Real losing space. population now? What the hell? It should be equal. Why? Okay, that's weird. I don't know why you guys are losing population. Winter is coming! Okay, Winter right, so is gather coming. Men more men around oh, over command, here. We're barely making money right now. That's the something. I think it's because that unit is free upkeep in there. No, it's not actually. Okay, but uh, these guys here, they are now free upkeep. I can bring all of these guys over here. I won't disappoint. I will do and they are not moving. I'm sorry. Gods be good. Winter is coming. I'm going to have basically you guys will just keep sitting here and waiting. Wait Winter until they are in a position a where it's just world. one army. If it's Put one army dots. at a time, we can handle that. If it's multiple of these stacks at a time, that's when things are a problem. Uh, you need to keep trying wine. to explore a little bit more around here. Oh, hey, there's some of the undead lands. Uh, also, I need to figure out where I need to actually like, explore down here. Let's go that way. Let's try and go up that way. Uh, was that eight stars there? Um, I don't think so. Remembers. No, you were still at seven. You were still at seven in that battle there. Okay, the I do North have a lot remembers. more men Winter that are making their way here, so go against the black, the all of you. The North remembers. You're also making your way to help out. So basically I'll have it so that all of these guys will... Join you, you up this way as well, Martin Mormont. I'll probably have you kind of take over remembers. this command of this army that's Winter helping us out. Coming. Although, we've got all these guys the making North their remembers. way over so they can be what you use, I would say. Okay, I'm going to do an end turn. I'm going to be right back while it is doing the end turn, so give me one second. I need to use the restroom. I will do as you command, my lord. Begging you, gods be good. Our house will never fall. Come get it, you bastard. Okay, I am back. Uh, I'm sure what? I think you can send my character north of the wall now. Yep, I just did that. Start building the main army wall at the harbor. Uh, I don't have... Well, the thing is right now, Gabe, we don't have money. I'm I'm making, like, nothing at the moment. And remember, every unit has a, an upkeep of, like, Winter three to four hundred. Actually, I think, technically, Bravos has, like, nothing in it. So we might actually be fine. Oh. Lord Bolton will see you put in the torch. Um, just a second there. I'm going to have you walk back to White Harbor, just in case, as I see this fleet here. So I will uh, go over here. I need to actually try and get a better navy. I, I was wondering if there was going to be any rebel fleets. Uh, initially there weren't, but I'll have you just walk over towards White Harbor for now. That's awesome rant. Send Theo, Dustin, and Gabe. Yes. Let's see my Did the Wildling survive? Yes, the Wildling survived because the game crashed. The Wait, game crashed and actually made us the use to live. Oh, good. Okay, now. This is better. So, we can now kind of start whittling these guys down now that they're in a better position. So, we can try and have you go over here. This has got one, two, three. So this has got five. This has five giants. Um, let's have you go there. The Move you guys up here. The Same with you. Oh, actually, I should have put that here. Into there, but that's fine. The okay. So let's start trying to clear out these guys around us. I'm gonna have it so these are actually on the map. I want to have everybody on the map all at the same time. Come get it, you bastard. 
It's yeah, and you've been answering. Um, let's see. Can I claim one of the cities we conquer for the dustins? You can most certainly, Joshua Bone Fogati. Any city that we conquer, everybody is available to try and uh, claim it and try and buy it for, uh, to claim it for themselves. You don't have to be a uh, part of the conquest to take part or to uh, try and have it for yourself. If it's conquered and you are the first to bid on it and you win the bid, there you go. Just have you guys get right there and then start the battle. And then I'm going to wait until my allies get on the map. And then hopefully they're not idiots. Although, again, with this army, we'll have you guys be shootout stance. I'm going to have you guys kind of maybe be in front. There's so many fucking trees. So what we want you to do, we want you guys to make your way forward. And then I'm going to move up as well. I'm going to move up. I'm going to make sure I actually kind of go more up around. Uh, yeah, I'm going to do this. I'm going to kind of go to about this point. About here. You guys to about here. And then my cab to about here. And then I'll have you guys. I'm going to have you try and go from this side. So kind of guard position. Go over here. Then we can kind of surround them. How's my army looking? Uh, it's starting to come together, Unwanted Hydra. That's just not me. Then I would be claiming him and make him a cell sword. Alrighty. I don't remember what this guy's name is, but if he survives this fight... Oh, it's, it's the Walls Riger. So if Walls Riger survives this battle... Um, I will put you down as him, but I don't know if he's going to survive. <laughs> so, uh, Ryan Neely, I'll put you down as him. So, Ryan Neely. And I'll put you down as Wallace Ryan. Good. And then I'll put Sellsword, and we'll have to see if he survives this fight. Because this army has um, five giants. There are five giants in this army, so they guys should do quite a bit. Let's see. Uh, what did you call White Harbor? Uh, Ram, did you just insult White Harbor? What? What are you talking about? I don't know what you're talking about. I, I didn't. I said nothing of the sort to insult White Harbor. Uh, back what I missed. Uh, game crashed, and we uh, were getting our asses kicked by a bunch of giants. Gil's computer ran out of power, and we've got his charger at home. Oh shit. I see, then we were able to. Can I raise an army of Unsullied if they are in this mod? They are in this mod. Unsullied are in this mod. I feel like everybody just wanted me to conquer the entire world. If we're gonna. Because if we want Unsullied, we have to basically conquer the entire world for the most part. If he dies, he dies. Alrighty. Oh, he called it Shite Harbor. Oh! I did not notice that. I did not notice that initially. How dare you! It is the jewel of the north right now. It makes me all my money. I'm literally only making money because of that city. <laughs> Old gods rule the world. Indeed they do. Okay. I think we're just about in position. Some of the giants are on the side here. I see two of the giants. Because that's what we're going to be trying to do. So I... Just about in position. So we'll kind of line up more like... So, and so. Archer specifically get in range. We need to start whittling down the giants, because I saw there's five of them in this army. So there's two over here. I think one of the generals is a giant yet. One of the generals is a giant. The giants are the ones that can't hide. And the other giants are over here, right? I think so. They're supposed to be. Oh, yeah, they're there. There's one more. Okay, so I'll wait until I open up and I kill these two. Then I'm going to tell my allies to start trying to make their way forward to try and kill the others. Are the Unsullied, like, uh, green ghosts from Divine Conquer? I don't think so. I think they're more akin to, like, my normal units that I have. Like, my normal infantry units, I think. I don't know if, they, I, if they're if they as badass as they are, like, the, the green units from Divine Conquer. I don't think so, at least. I'm not sure. Just keep moving you guys up here. Right there, right there. Let's see. I want to go to Kohor and raise it all... Uh, but that's my own goal. I, I say we stop recruiting for armies that don't really need it. And that's the thing, like... I want everybody to, be able to try and have their sellsword armies, but I feel like I have to, like, straight up, like, tax you guys, technically, for the, your units, and be like, okay, if you have these units, you have to pay me this money per turn. Um, because otherwise, at the moment, 
we kind of uh, run out of a lot of money with everybody wanting to have their cell sword armies. So my guys are set up there. My archers. Where'd the giants go? Oh, one's dead already. Did we kill both their giants already? I see one corpse. So we for sure killed one giant. Um, I think this one... Yeah, this one's still alive. Try and shoot that one, guys. Yeah, run into position, guys. Need to make sure you're in position before they get near us. I don't see... the other giants. Is there one over here? Yeah, okay, so there's one giant over here. We've killed one for sure. Yeah, well, uh, unsully the North shall rule the world. Like, we need to focus on recruitment for the campaign, and we really need it. Yeah, we really do right now. I think if we take Bravos, we can kind of care a little bit less, because I know Bravos can make a ton of money. But the fact is, we've just been conquering and taking a lot of... Oh, hello. Run back there, please. Uh, that's one. That's gotta be one of the giants. Is he? Oh, is he dead? Oh, is he dead or not dead? Okay, keep focusing on him. Oh, but I think there's some on the other side too. Yep, uh, I just can't fucking see him. But I know one of them is over here. Okay, game. I need to slow this down. Uh, get away from Jojen Reed. Or, sorry, Jory uh, Hornwood. Get the fuck away from him. Okay, I need uh, these archers to shoot that bastard. Oh, he's dead now. Never mind. Now we just need to focus on the other one. So we've taken out uh, three now. There's another giant right there. Number wise, 12 to 2. Not bad. My allies. Uh, what the hell are you doing? Oh, you're fighting the other two giants. Okay, so I've taken out about three giants. You're trying to fight over here, so you are actually doing something. Okay. Good to know. I was worried you were just sitting there doing nothing. Is that other giant dead? Uh, no, it's not dead yet. Major dies. Once it's dead, then we can unload on everybody else. Come on, kill it. Kill it, kill it, kill it. Okay, he's running away from my archers at least. There we go, that makes it easier to shoot you. Come on. How are my allies doing for numbers? They've only lost like 80 guys, it's not that bad. Come on, finish off the giant. I wonder if they're killing their own units. Iron Bank should take priority for money. It'll be needed for the world to come. And we can have the Southern Houses ransom with the money they own the bank. And personally, wouldn't be a mistake if you agree. Sometimes, as long as that means I get more than uh, free Glover units. Uh, well, the amount of Glover units you'll get are is tied to directly the amount of command you're at right now. Where did that giant go? Honestly, I almost want to just turn off the fucking trees. I can't see where they all went. Oh god, that's a lot of you. Okay, calf, kind of pull away there. I have no idea if the giant's still alive. A lot of you guys are wavering here. Actually, just charge this blob. I think the giant died. So let's just charge this blob. It should break pretty easily. Yeah, just run them all down there. Uh, maybe we can kill the king, but... Uh, I don't heard that from me. Well, don't... Which king specifically? Remember, there's many kings at the moment going on throughout the world at the moment as uh, Aegon's trying to do his conquests. As long as it's not me, the king of the north, I don't mind us killing whatever king we fucking want to. I still have no idea if they need giants around here. The enemy are badly blooded. 
They have lost half their Most men. of them are at least breaking. I think I can have you guys start trying to be aggressive more. You're starting to do quite a bit of damage. I th they haven't killed the generals and the other, the giants on the other side, I don't believe. Right now, it's just trying to run down as many as we can. We've now captured a thousand of them. Two thirds of the enemy army is dead. I think my infantry, I'm actually going to give you guys AI commands. And let's have you guys kind of go after some of these cannibals, specifically. For the most part, everybody else is breaking, so we just need to kind of run them down. And then I think the, their general's still alive. Yeah, that giant's still alive. So my allies are really bad at killing any giants. So we didn't kill any of them just yet. Okay, so I just need to keep running these guys down. Let's see. Uh, let's see. Actually, I am probably going to use most of my wealth now to start building up an army for the invasion of Bravos. I mean, Aegon, not the Star King. I wonder, because I know this mod has dragons. I still haven't been able to check out and test whether or not this mod, uh, this campaign, for specifically we're playing right now, this scenario, has uh, gives Aegon dragons. I think it does. Um, and I hope it does. I wonder if he has them spawned by now yet. Because we're on, like, turn 40 now at this point in the campaign. So we're getting up there in turns. Quite a bit, at least. So I would hope that at some point he has dragons. I wonder if they're going to be as disgusting as fighting some of these giants. Although the giants are really easy, at least, to deal with with skirmishes, at least. I think for the most part... Like, the cannibals are still fighting back here. We've ran down most of their units now at this point. I think all that's left are the giants my allies never killed. So I think that's all we have to finish off. So the, the cannibals and the giants. So I think I'm actually going to tell my skirmishers. Start to make your way over here. We need to start trying to shoot you. Because then the battle should be done. I'm just not going to have you try and face them. You just need to try and run down anybody that's still alive. Yeah, they do. And they are OP as fuck. Aw, oh, yeah. I wonder if I can bribe them. I wonder if I could bribe the dragon armies. If I could, if I can bribe the dragon armies, I'm so going to do it. Also, I'm still sad that I don't think we have like princesses on the map, so I don't think we'll be able to try and seduce the Night King. Still, sadly, I'm kind of sad that we won't be able to do that for this campaign. Okay, so now all that's left should be the giants. The battle is very much in our favor. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. Uh, how long are we streaming for today? Uh, about another 20, 30 minutes-ish. Let's see, I need friends and court rich friends. Uh, like I said last stream, dragons and three shot full stacks. I wonder if they have, like, the... Because, well... You guys haven't seen this yet, but it's in the Mordor campaign that I've recorded for tomorrow. Um, I wonder if they use the same breath attack that Sauron has. has. If they can do that, I can very easily see them uh, three-shotting a full-stack army. I can very easily see them doing that. Let's see what's left over here. There's somebody over here. Oh, there's just like one javelin there. One javelin there. Archers, yeah, you just need to focus on the generals. Because once this giant is dead, then we're done for. It's just this guy here. Uh, wait, is this other one nearby? Oh yeah, this one's getting close. Focus on him first. I really hate that we don't have any horse archers. Horse archers would be broken as shit against giants. Okay, he's broken. Just kill him. Make sure he's dead. Okay, so that giant's now dead. We now just need to get rid of the other one. I mean, you already saw Sarwan's breath attack last video. Oh no, it's worse. It's worse, Patrick Robinson. There's a better example of how bad it can be in the next video. A far better example. Come on, finish them off. Yeah, they are proper OP. Awesome. Dragons have to be properly OP. Otherwise, it feels very strange. Uh, want to hear something cool? Sure. What is it? As we're still trying to just chase this one bastard down. He just keeps running away from us. The dragons have more OP breath than Sauron. It's like a Greek fire breath that one-shots anything. Well, the Sauron breath attack... 
Um, from what I've seen in the Divine Conquer AGO sub mod with the one campaign I'm doing right now, it's basically a Greek fire breath attack that expands somehow. Good that's tidings. There the enemy Finally general dead. lies dead. We have all okay. of Christendom will Lost be in all of Lost the victory we guys. have won here today. But for the most part, that's us taking out an entire army of 3,700 wildlings. Captured half of them. Not bad, guys. Then we shall wait and see. Uh, well, I found out I'm ace last week. I am not surprised by that fact whatsoever. Who's ace? Gilbert is ace. Uh, I thought Sauron's Breath was a catapult. Oh, no, 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 no. The most recent version, recent version uh, that I'm using in the current Mordor campaign I'm doing, it is more akin to the Greek fire units in Medieval 2, but it, like, expands and spreads out. Uh, no, what's Abyss? Uh, what's... It, he means, a. Uh, yeah, Ace just means asexual. Well, the thing is, Gilbert, uh, I'm I'm demisexual, which is on the uh, asexual spectrum, and at times, or at least sometimes, th there's two types of people that I meet: either completely adverse, uh, sexual adverse people on the asexual asexual spectrum, or they're so far that they like make so many jokes about it, but they don't actually have any connection to it, and you kind of fit in that category. Come get it, you bastard. Okay, so we can execute all of you. And then I'm gonna merge men together. Winter is coming. And let's grab Winter more men to put into Winter is coming. these three. Winter is coming. I'm a man of my word. Because we keep this army in the tip top shape and everybody else is just kind of following around. Winter is and we're slowly bringing more men up this way. Okay. So I can make you this way. The and then remembers. you'll be there in a couple turns. But at least we've now taken that Winter one army coming. out. I can probably bring my forces back kind of down this oh, Actually, make sure you stay near that army, Come just in case. Bastard. I'm a man of my word. I won't disappoint. But yes, uh, Ryan Neely, Neely, you did survive. Uh, what is ace actually? Just best way to describe it. Uh, yeah, actually, Gilbert is uh, having a good description there. Basically, the, the simplest terms is uh, asexual just means you do not feel normal sexual attraction that other people do. You have very little or no sexual attraction whatsoever. The is uh, that's the best way to describe it. It's the simplest way, actually. Not best. Simplest way. Winter is coming. Um, let's see. So everything else there. I do need to keep making sure we're building more stuff. Oh, hey, we have a new uh, J.R. Flint. We have a new Flint. And I don't know why he is way over here. But okay, we have a new Flint. Perfect. Um, I actually think I need to send you maybe over westward. Actually, I think that's why we're making this money now is because we have so many random gems coming of age. But you guys can go there. We almost have this army together. There's two more here. So we've got about half a stack for this army. I survived. I would like to see Winterfell. Alrighty, I can try and send you down that way to Winterfell. So let's see. So, well, you have no, oh, no, you do have some movement. So I can try and send you down to Winterfell. Make your way over that way. And then, uh, Winter is coming. Money? Oh, we're making a little bit more now for money. Winter Good. Is coming. Because I do need to make sure we can continue building stuff. Especially in um, here. I need 2600 for that. Because I just desperately need to keep improving my economy as much as I can. Oh, we're starting to get a bit more corruption. Eh, not a ton, but a little bit more. Sorry, I'm done. 243? Okay. I, see, I haven't seen the most recent mortar videos. Oh, they're, they're, they're some fun. Uh, make sure you're moving towards White Harbor. You are. You should still be moving towards White Harbor. Uh, I'll see that in a second. Oh, no, never mind. I didn't get to. Because I had to take you off that I'm boat for now, moment. at least. Because I'm a little concerned if I send you, you across with just that one ship, you might be attacked. Wait, if I get it? Okay. Um, let's see. Uh, just, does Theo doesn't have I'll a do wife ramp? I Lord. don't know. Um, I only can see the Stark family tree, so I have no idea if you guys have, um, uh, oh, we have, no, we have Plague, no, don't die, Rob Mormont, 
If you die of plague, I'm gonna be so sad. The North remembers. I'm gonna be so sad because so far he's just been doing word. nothing up there, just chilling. I won't disappoint you. I still can't you build it up there. Uh, oh wait, no, do we have another reed? Oh, I didn't realize we had another reed. Actually, he is the one in um, Caitlin. Actually. Oh, okay. Uh, but you over here. Coming. So the almost North got this full stack army. Here, or about half the stack. The remembers. Winter is coming. I will do as you command, my there. lord. There. I'm gonna save our money for now. Winter I'm gonna keep coming. trying to save our cash. Honestly, I might need to get rid of some of these. Oh, there actually isn't a lot of devastation. It's more so corruption is starting to kick out more so. So I think that's more what we have to worry about. The North um, remembers. So there are. The North remembers. Okay, so Winter you can move up this way. I will do as you command. Winter and then I'll is have, coming. So you. The North remembers. Yeah, you take 13. So there's the North remembers. literally one guy off. God damn it! I'm just gonna get rid of this guy. There's three of you. Winter is there's coming. three of you. I can the then North have us go merge with this army. Winter is coming. Um, and they're the actually. Oh. Your place. Hello. Hello. I say we fight. Let's go. One, two, three. So they also got five giants there. But, oh man, are you up to... Oh, no, you're still up to five. You just hit plus three now when you do this. But you're I think right. we'll kill you guys, because then that means the Fist of the First Men is completely free. Let's see, have him back. Uh, do I have an army yet? Uh, sadly, not just yet, Pit Fighter. Uh, so you're going on for about another 15 minutes? Yes, about 15-ish minutes. It, it is, it, it, technically it is still for educational purposes, uh, Gilbert, but it does still, it is still too much information. At least that's how I would describe it. Let's grab all my archers. Put you guys all up. There's at least no trees this time, thankfully, so it's a bit easier for us to make sure that we can shoot all of their giants down. They are also hiding really far back. Oh, they're hiding in the fucking trees! So they are... I see two of the giants there. So we have to walk all the way up here. Let's bring all of you guys up this way. There, there, and there. And then my calves. So everybody make your way over this way. Moving to White Harbor. The Invasion of the Veil is put on hold until we have Bravos. Uh, it's not too much information to relative to my usual message. Your your usual message is usually too much information, Gilbert. <laughs> um, let's see. I'm going to head off ramp. Everyone, until next time. Wish you good fortune in the wars to come. All righty, my good sir. Good to have you here, my man. Patrick, child, I need to declare. I don't know if it, that specifically was necessary to clarify. What people were like, yeah, we get the idea. Gil, you're like 14. <laughs> yes, fact check. Okay, let's get you these guys up here. I'm gonna actually have you guys kind of run a little bit more into position. So they've got five giants we're gonna have to make sure we're careful of. They have the high ground, which kind of bugs me. But they've got two down here, two over here, and one right there. So they're pretty consistent with that, at least. Maybe, you don't know. Gilbert, that's your sister! I think she knows your age! Man, the battle map diversity is so refreshing, uh, though it might explain why it crashes so much. I actually think that might be partially why, because this mod has some really unique... Like, look at this. You can really tell we're, like, right next to the fucking wall, and I love it. Like, the map diversity is really nice in this mod so far, but it is really unstable. That's, the, like, the only downside. It is a bit unstable. It is better, like, honestly. This is far more bearable to deal with than what it was doing when I was trying to make the map. When I was trying to make the map for the land and, um, merchant title stuff, it was crashing continuously. And now, at least, it's far more stable. But this engine overhaul expansion project does wonders at times, honestly. It really does a lot. Oh, also, uh, I forgot to respond to your DM message that you sent me, Gilbert. Yes, I think that makes sense. I think that makes sense for what is going on. Okay, now, 
Do they adjust? Yeah, they do adjust. Can't do that. Let's try and go to about here. Shoot to about here. And then cap to about here. Um, he has truly replaced Flower. <laughs> I love that for anybody that hasn't been watching me for a long time, they wonder what the fuck are we talking about when we reference this flower. <laughs> they don't know, like, what the hell do you mean? What are you talking about with this flower? And then I'll just say Australia. And that is it. That is all I will give for context to make that make more sense. Instead, if people want to really know, they must look through all my content, all my streams, and then they'll understand. <laughs> Right, that isn't even the wall, that's the Frost Fangs Oh, I know, I know. It's just it's showcasing that we are so close to the wall because we have all these mountains around here. Because I know the mountain, uh, the, the wall is technically like... Oh, actually! Actually, I think that is the wall right there. Like, straight up, I think that's the wall. God, I miss having the map, like, the map generation like this. Like, that's the one thing I di I I'm kind of sad about in more recent Total Wars, is... Like, I can just straight up see... Oh yeah, that's the fucking wall over there. It's just in the distance. Like, god, that's so cool. I us get back. What have I missed? Uh, currently we are killing more of the giants. Let's see, uh, yeah, why doesn't Flower join streams anymore? Um, because he fixed his sleep schedule. <laughs> I think that's primarily the main reason, is... Flower kind of fixed his sleep schedule for the most part, and he hasn't been having really bad sleep schedules, so he hasn't been joining nearly as often. Um, I can't say the only thing with Charles. I think Charles, he just hasn't been joining as often because he's been kind of more busy with life stuff. But I, I think with uh, Flower, for the most part, it's because his sleep schedule is actually fixed. Is it the same Flower who comments sometimes after I post Katie Docs? Yes. I'm back. What I miss? Uh, more giant killing. We killed one giant army of giants. We're now trying to move on up to take out this other group. I don't like how they're up here. I think I might try and take like you two. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna have you guys move forward because you're almost dead. Uh, I'm gonna have you guys run up and I'm gonna have you try and shoot the giants specifically and lure them closer to us. Because at the moment, I want them to come over to me and let me shoot one giant at a time. So I'll send these about 60 odd guys forward. Try and have you get close enough so you can shoot them. Uh, yeah, but it was worse during the Stormcloak campaign. Oh, it was really bad during the Stormcloak campaign. Uh, last time I saw a flower was Crusader States. Uh, let's see. Me and Janie are going to do the duel to model. Rebellion against the St Stark's going to start cool. Uh, then for the lack of a better phrase, I think I have a taste of what you were mentioning when you discussed this flower. <laughs> it does feel weird that I forgot, like, you actually haven't been around for uh, long enough to properly fully experience that sometimes, uh, Patrick. Uh, okay, one of you can shoot them. Okay, one of you can hit them. Come on. Can you both hit them soon? Oh, that's why. The Umber Bowmen are just faster. Try and hit this guy. Hopefully they just let me kill one of the giants here. Which is these like 60 guys. Uh, those are spearmen. Please ignore me. Don't don't mind my 60 odd guys that are trying to kill giants. Uh, run away, please. Run away. They're probably gonna kill you all with those jab. Yep, there we go. Uh, are they gonna advance onto us yet? No, not yet. Okay, well, I have to my other archer still. I've at least bloodied them a little bit. I'll try and see if we can kill one of these guys. If we can kill one of these giants with just a couple guys here, I'll be very happy about that. Yeah, try and... Oh, and then... So there we go. Keep shooting them. So at least these two are making their way over. Uh, the other giants... Uh, they haven't moved yet. Bones are dead. The bones are dead. Has he done anything for the, with the wall? Um, not yet. Starks go cringe. Hey, at least these Starks aren't as bad. I'd say these Starks aren't as cringe. Kill the other giant yet? No, the other. Okay, so they sent another one actually. So 
focus on them. Come on, kill the giants. There's one giant's dead there. That one's not dead yet either. Okay, you two keep trying to focus on this one. We killed at least one giant. There's one giant down. We need to kill four more. Uh, please don't charge at me. You walked into them and they died! Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna move my force up a little bit more. I'm gonna have you guys kind of move up to about here. These archers move up a little bit as well to about here. And yes, hello Damien! It's been a while since you've been able to join in for a stream. Keep trying to shoot the giants. Because we've at least taken out one. At least this guy's still just chilling here. Please get close enough for my other archers so we can shoot you. I think you guys might be in the range here. Because he's kind of... Yeah, he's getting closer. Okay, so now finish off this giant. Some of you can hit him. And as soon as I say that, he starts running around back. Damn it! I think I really, I really started watching you around the Gator campaign, but I couldn't get to the streams till your pseudo stream. Uh, I agree with myself. Yeah. And that's, and, uh, Flower was definitely more active primarily before that. Okay, so there's two giants dead. So there's two giants dead, there's just one more over here. I'm gonna try and bring these guys back over this way, try and shoot this one again. I think we can kind of move a little bit closer now, though, so let's kind of move to about here. So we're slowly gonna keep inching forward as we kill more giants. Hey, oh, Crazy Dutchman, how's it going, man? Welcome back. Are you seriously just going to keep walking backwards? If you guys slowly give me the high ground, I'll be happy about that. But at the moment, you're just kind of slowly walking away from me. So I'm kind of moving forward with my skirmishers here. And here, about there and there. There you go. It went well. Uh, were you streaming anyways, Crazy Dutchman? As he is like me when it comes to showing for streams, the first stream I get into was the Khajiit stream. We named Serge. We renamed cities after famous cats. Yes. Famous cats. We're gonna gloss over the fact that we were... We, every city... No, no, actually. No, 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 sorry. It wasn't until the Argonian campaign that everything was a sexual innuendo. Okay, no, the cat... The Khajiit stream wasn't as bad. No, no, no. Now that I remember, yeah. No, the Khajiit stream wasn't as bad. Uh, please tell me you named one for, for, for Mufasa. I don't think we did. I don't think we did. Although, actually, if they're going to, I might... Nah, I'm not going to have enough time to get up and take this one. But I will just keep slowly moving up. Here, here. my cap can kind of actually move up properly, too. First stream I got to was Arnor, uh, three stream. Okay, yeah, the Arnor stream campaign was a fun one. How about the Argonian campaign? Biggest dickus. <laughs> Biggest slight on a country ever. Hey, your, your capital, the Imperial City? We're going to rename it Imperial biggest dickus. If you want to do any trade or diplomatic uh, talks with us, you must refer to the city as biggest dickus. That was totally what we needed to do. Um, let's see, so on there was the other scrolls on official match one. Oh, nice! Which factions were you playing, uh, Crazy Dutchman? I blame Flower for their goading campaign. His call to Fornius got me too strong. <laughs> I've returned. Welcome back, Kill Scribe. I've been around for more than, like, two years now. That's kind of crazy to think. Because I've been doing the, I've been streaming, uh, recruit, all. Well, I've been properly streaming for now, for quite a bit now, actually, at this point in time. It feels weird to me to say that I've been, for the most part, kind of trying to consistently stream for about at least two years now, roughly, at least. How much progress have we made? Um, well, we've killed a lot of people on our way towards the Fist of the First Men. Uh, we're trying to slowly push on into this city right now, or in this area right now. Um, trying to make my way up to start killing their giants. I need to just move fucking closer. Because at the moment, okay, just move faster. Move closer up. It's like right there. I so killed two giants, I need to kill three more, and then this army's gonna be pretty easy to take out. Let's move a little bit closer. Um, excuse me. Didn't you make the horny bonk specifically for flower? Oh, yeah. Originally, the horny bonk was supposed to be for flower, but then it was just used on Gilbert a ton. That's what originally happened. You guys are just slowly backing up. Continuously just backing up, slowly but surely. Okay, you are actually being able to shoot. We haven't killed that many of you guys just yet. 
Giants are still alive there. My, ar my actual army might be properly in range after this in a second. I'm gonna, I think someone did like all my cats. Fist of the First Men. Sexual child. God damn it. I kind of walked into that one, yeah. I most of it. Okay, we're actually now in range. There we go. Now we can actually start hitting the army. There we go. Divide a whole bunch of factions. Uh, Kings of Black Marsh, Tribes of Rosinium, High Kingdom of Somerset, and the Clans of Reach, if I'm not mistaken. Nice! Can Giant die? Or just run forward and just start killing my shit now? Oh no, it's dead. So if it died. So we need you to start shooting other guys here. Oh, actually, did one charge in? Yep, one charge in. Uh, try and focus him down. I think it's just these two giant slugs. It's you and the one in back. My cab. I'm gonna have you go up around this hill now. Skirmishers, I need you to focus on the giant. Focus him down, please. As soon as he's dead, then we just have to focus on one more giant, and then the army will crumble. Come on, please kill him. Okay, you guys over here, at least, I think I'm actually gonna tell you to just try and shoot the channel with them. The giants back here. Oh, actually, you can't hit him from there. Damn it. Okay, so we have to focus on this giant first. Okay, Cav, up and about. Come on, giant. I need you to die. Oh, shit. They're going after my gap. Run back, run back, run back, run back. Run away from that. Do not fight that thing. Do not fucking fight that thing. Get away from that. Archers, please kill him. Some of you are shooting him. Not many of you are shooting him, though. My creative charm. Can you play Realm of Thrones for Bandlord, maybe? I, I want to. It's been brought up actually a couple times during the stream campaign so far. That I do want to try and play that. Because I think after this stream campaign, um, I either want to... I kind of want to go back to my Skyrim campaign for a little bit in some regard. I kind of want to go back to Skyrim a little bit. I also kind of want to do Bannerlord for a little bit. Oh, they've got cannibals there. Shit. You guys need to play. This is not going the way I want it to. Here's a 22. I'm running this way. Is that giant dead? I don't see it anymore. Yeah, this is the general right now. You guys can shoot him, please. These four as well, kind of pull him inside. As soon as that thing is dead, he's trying to currently go after my cavalry. Stay near my archers. Stay near my archers. Open up on the giant, please. Kill him off. Just keep trying to run around a little bit longer until it dies. Because as soon as it dies, then we can run down the rest of the army. Because a lot of them are already shaken. By the sins, there we go. Our men have slain the enemy general. Okay. Without Try them, and now push forward there, my archers. The fight. All of them. Oh, my, sorry, my calf. Uh, archers, pull back. Uh, we need to focus on cannibals with the archers. Everybody else should break with my, with my cavalry. Yep, already some of them are starting to run. Okay. Calf, start running them down. Skirmishers, try and pull back a little bit. And then we need you to primarily focus on cannibals. Oh, I feel like you're doing this to you. If you do, go to the tavern's like bottom option, and you'll have to find out what that is. Okay, interesting. Uh, I'll have to see. Uh, I'll, I don't know when I'll be able to get to it, but I know I'm gonna try and check out that mod at some point, uh, for sure, Damien. Because it's been, it has been a while since I've been able to properly play uh, Bannerlord, and I want to for sure. Uh, oh, actually, they are throwing things at us. I need to try and charge you guys. Try and break these guys here. My lord, the tide of battle seems to have turned against us. Uh, we must act and hope this be okay. Out. Yeah, no, they're starting to open. Okay, now my archers. Yeah, you guys are good. It's primarily just the cannibals I'm worried about now at this point. Although, uh, actually, I'm going to put back here. There's a lot of... Oh, shit. There's way more javelins here than I thought they were shooting me. Okay, pull away, pull away, pull away. We need my archers to do more for a second. So pull out of there, guys. Please don't get Patrick Robinson killed. Come on, guys, run. 
You gotta run. Okay, you are getting out of it. Yeah, pull back. I thought they were gonna break more easily, but they aren't, so we have to actually let my archers do some work for a second. Probably that's fine. Yeah, we have to whittle them down a little bit more before we start charging them. Okay, so pull back here. I need you guys to go right there. You guys are good. By the Almighty Lord oh, actually, I need you to try can and... Bring us victory from this mess. Yeah, we're just there. We need to get more. So we're currently at 42. Yeah, you guys are safe. I think we still have this. It's just the cannibals are the issue. Like, you guys trying to shoot the cannibals. These are all just javelins. So I just need to get you guys to be out of melee with me, and then we can finish them off. Okay. Our How many turns is a year? It's, I, I, I think it's supposed to be four for this, uh, four turns per year in this mod. Although, actually, wait, we're on turn 40, and uh, the game starts, isn't it zero? Yeah, no, no, yeah. It's supposed to start at 0 AL, and we're on currently 10 AL. So it is supposed to be uh, 4 turns per year. This way. Guys, you're supposed to, like, shoot the cannibals, not fight them in melee. Guys, how many troops uh, are... How, many, how are my troops routed when I have 8 command? Something changes in the well, of they are really low the on troops, and I think that's the main certain. issue. But we are pulling ahead. We're catching up. It's just this one cannibal unit has to die. Because there's just a bunch of javelins right now. I see a bunch of javelins, and that's it. Which right now, literally, just kind of, yeah, stay around here. Try and shoot what you can. Cannibals are at 24. So they're almost dead. Are those guys dead yet? Almost. Okay, so now we're at the point where I am... Just about to... Yeah, okay, so now we just need to shoot them. We just need to keep shooting them, and then once my guys run out of all, all of their ammo, then we're going to start charging them. But for right now, just keep on shooting them. Yeah, now they're kind of rushing on up. Oh, yeah, focus on those cannibals first and foremost. Cannibals are the biggest issue because they have unlimited morale. I don't see anybody else. Turn my cap over back around this way. I need to get more cap into you, into this army. Get you guys can pull back a little bit. Because I want to take advantage of our increased range over them. So pull back, guys. Number wise, 71 to 66. Yeah, keep pulling back. Keep staying far enough away that you can keep shooting them, but they can't keep shooting you. It's like you guys over there. You guys over there, and I'll wait until we whittle them down, and then I can start charging in with my cavalry, hopefully. Uh, I don't think you've ever ha heard my voice, have you? I don't think so, Damien. I do not believe so, actually. Okay, this guy, I'm gonna have you rush in. You have no ammo anymore. So I'm gonna use start trying to fight in melee. Everybody else just keep firing until you run out of ammo. I think once we get... Once we outnumber them again, we can start trying to charge them. I'm just a little worried. Although, at this point in time, actually, I think we can start charging. I think we can charge in here and cause some chain rounds. Because they're all shaken or wavering. So I think it's possible. Yeah, no, a lot of you guys are breaking again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, run over here. Bounce power is more in our favor than it is in theirs. Archers, I'm actually going to tell you guys to AI command and just charge in. Everybody get in here. I think this should do... I think this should do the them in. Yeah, there we go. Chain route. Yeah, massive chain route there. Remains as such. Yep, pretty much everybody's chain routing. There's just a couple that aren't. But yeah, no, everybody charge into melee. Start trying the to run them down. Yeah, there we go. The okay, now we just have to After run them down. Them, cut the down. Uh, so we Now, can I please just make sure I run all of you guys down? I don't think we're gonna get the Magic 85. They're too close to the edge of the map here. Okay, there's like some guys over here I can still run down. That was a, actually, there was like three, four hundred guys over there. Might be able to get the Magic 85. But I think because of the terrain that these guys are at, they're still gonna all die anyways, even if we didn't get the Magic 85. 
But I desperately do need to make sure we get some more reinforcements. Oh, we almost are out of time. Come on, keep burning them all down. Capture the rest of these guys before the battle's over, please. But I desperately do need to get some more reinforcements up here to help out. Because we've almost pushed to the first Vista First Men now, at least at this point. Which I'm hoping that we've done a decent amount of damage to the, um, in, uh, well, to the military of the Freedom Group. What's that last unit? How many are left in that unit? Oh, there's like just a couple. That's fine. So we can just end the battle there. We are victorious. Average victory. Our Lost a lot of guys though. Fought and died well yeah, recovered a couple. Not the worst. Oh, excuse me. Nope. Yeah. Don't want to have my phone flying. Burn. That's even worse. You lost so many damn men. Yeah, it took us longer to get rid of the uh, giants than I would have liked in that battle. My army is gone. Rip. Well, no, we have reinforcements. Ah, we have reinforcements that are coming in the form of uh, the other guys that are making their way over. We just have to merge the two forces together. And then I think because we lost so many men now, we can start recruiting some more men from the Umberlands and bring them up here to help out and reinforce us. Knock on wood ramp. I will do so. Oh, is my thing also really far back? Oh, yeah, that's why. There we go. But we've at least made some good progress. I think we'll do one more turn end. And then I think we'll be done for today, because I don't think anything's going to happen during the turn end. So we should be able to see how things are going to fare for us in the next stream. Where I'm hoping that now that we've been able to push towards the Fist of the First Man, they don't have that many armies left. Although, because the Wildlings are so cheap, I would not be surprised if they do have a couple more full snack armies like that. But yeah, execute all those guys. Winter is oh, so beat up. So beat up, but we have reinforcements back here. Winter is coming. And I'll just hope they don't attack us during the turn end. That's my hope. Winter I can at least like, bring all of you guys over here, at least like these four. Winter is coming. Is over. Begging your pardon. That's at least better. That's at least a little bit better there. Uh, he got more dread. Um, and did he get any Winter more command coming. from that? No, still no more command from that, sadly. But I do think um, last hearth. I should definitely have you try and recruit some more men for us to send over, as we desperately do need more guys to help us out. We've got a couple of guys making their way up here. Oh, yeah, Donald Talhart finally got to the Black uh, Castle Black. Ho ho! Uh, this is why the Starks never tried to conquer the far north. <laughs> yeah, it's making a lot more sense now, honestly. <laughs> making a lot more sense at this Get point in time, uh, given what, how this has been going. As all these. Oh my god. Look at this. Fuck, look at this shit. Oh my god. Like, we're making progress. But no, I still see, like, another full st two stacks there. But, uh, let's do another turn end. At least try and have a fresh turn for us. Let me make sure also that all my armies are moving forward. Yeah, you're moving forward. So, yeah. We'll be having an invasion for Bravo soon, though. I really do like that. So, let's get at least... God damn it. Okay. Game crashed as soon as I got that end turn there. Okay, that's awesome. I want to get one more fucking turn in, damn it. Let's see, Book Tyrion is messed up and Show Tyrion is done. Uh, did I make it to the wall? Yes, you are now at the wall. Just seize that army out, don't hack it. Yeah, I'm definitely going to, for sure, once we uh, make our way up to that settlement. If they're in a city, I'm going to siege it out. Did I make an autosave before I ended the turn? And... Okay. Why is it crashing when I'm trying to load the save? Should we not end now? I think we are. I want to try and make sure we can load into the campaign. Let me try that one more time. No, okay. Uh, let me see if I can make sure I can load into the quick save. I'm gonna hope this campaign's not dead on this. 
So let me try. Let me try the quick save. The quick save is before um, we did that just most recent battle. So I'll try and see if we can load the quick save. If we can load the quick save, the campaign's not dead, and I'll end it for today. I just want to make sure the campaign's not dead. Quick save. Okay. I think we're good. I think we're good. As long as it's able to load into the quick save, the campaign should still be able to continue. Rand's going to cry after stream. <laughs> loading, 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 just continuously loading. Whether or not we're going to be able to continue the campaign, I think we will be able to. Please do. Can I stop spamming? Yeah, please, please do, please do dub stop spamming. But I think it's good since it hasn't crashed yet. Ram Alt F4. No, I'm not Alt F4 when it's working. Don't tell anyone if it's corrupted or not. <laughs> I'm kind of tempted to almost, but no. Keep them in suspense. It's a little too late now because the thing is loading through. But okay, so it has loaded through. I will have it, so let's just do this. We did win the fight here, so we use the auto win attacker here. And then I'm just going to see if we can get through a turn out. Technically, you get to keep a lot more of your army now. But can I get the end turn? I will do as you command, my lord. Because I want to make sure it's able to go through a turn end. I think it should be okay, though. Okay, I think we're good. <laughs> I think we're good. I think the campaign will be able to continue to work. This is good. This is good. I understand. Okay, now we're going to be done for today. So, you forgot to move me? No, you you moved. You moved. You have uh, the auto movement stuff. The North you remembers. did move. But I think we'll be done for today. Please tell me he still hasn't died. He has not died. Good. Good, good. Okay, but I do think we are going to be done for today. So, I will not be able to lead the council for today. Um, I don't know if Danny is still here, but if she is available, she said she would be able to try and lead the council. Uh, Unwanted Hydra, you're still sitting in the same spot. You're, you're, you're still right here. The North remembers you're still sitting here. Winter you've got about half a coming. step. That's about it. Um, but yeah, Janny said she'd be trying to lead the council, and if she's not able to, I think Patrick Robinson said he would be able to as well. I will just be at D&D, &D, so I hope you guys have fun with the council, the after stream RP. But I'm going to be ending this stream for today. We will be doing more next weekend. Um, so I'm hoping you guys enjoyed this, but this is Rampant, and I'll see you guys next time.